Hello, this is Kyla Games, and I'm back with another Honkai Star Rail live stream. Now, uh, I know that I said I wasn't going to um, be streaming until Monday, so I can, you know, build my characters up so that I can be able to defeat um, um, Aventurine. However, there has been slight complication, or not complication, but rather a success, even. So, before we actually start the story, I need to explain this. And, hopefully y'all arrive by the time I start talking. But, I'll wait to see if anyone pops up, and then I can get to talking. Mm -mm -mm. Hopefully everyone rolls back up like they did back on Tuesday. I really want to share with y'all what happened. Mm -mm, but I'll wait because I refuse to click this X button until someone roll up. So I'm gonna keep this on. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go wash my hands. We're gonna get started. chat yes sir and I'll wait <clears throat> I'm not even gonna start yet I got time and also I can't really start yet because the moment I press this X button we're going we're hopping straight into a cutscene so yeah I'll wait till y'all roll up and then we'll begin
with my laptop set up. Yo, what's up, Julian? Okay, I'm glad you arrived because now I can talk about what I need to tell you what happened. So, um, hold up, is my TV too loud? I'm gonna turn my TV down a little bit. Give me a second. I guess I'll turn my fan off right now. Okay, so something unexpected happened yesterday, which I didn't think was gonna happen, but it ended up happening. So, I defeated Aventurine in his phase two. I, I, I beat him in his phase two. And it was completely by accident because the only reason it happened was because I was leveling up my characters, um, what was it? I, was, I leveled them up, I leveled their talents up, and I leveled up their light cones a little bit, right? And the way I was playing playing against him was like, oh, I thought you was about to say you got Venturini. Nah, I didn't get him yet. Hopefully I can get him within the next four weeks, but we gotta wait and see for that. But um, yeah. So the way, I, I gotta explain it for you to understand um, how it went down. So this is how it went down. I brought, of course, I brought um, Alcron, Serval, and Herta along with Natasha. And how I played was this. I will stack up a lot of, um, I'll accumulate a lot of the um, skill points. And anytime I had Natasha's ultimate ready and the team was low on health, I will heal the whole team up before he would throw his dice down for me to hit, right? I would allow Natasha to be hit by the dice so that she'll be out of, out of the count, right? I kept healing and let her get knocked down. Healing, letting her get knocked down where everyone else get healed. So when we got to phase two, it went different. I did the same method. I would have everybody else be able to hit all the um all four dice, yada yada yada. Everyone else would do it. She wouldn't. She would heal the team up first before the attack hits, yada yada yada. So she can still survive while the rest of the team continues to do the attacking. So so this is how it did. We was in the last home stretch. Serval dropped first. My second electro unit was down. Then after her, um, Natasha dropped down too. And then finally, I was able to crush him in his phase two with Herda and um, Alcaron still being up with her, both of their bursts being ready to use. So I managed to survive and kill him, what defeat his second phase before he would land his next attack. Cause he was next up on the list to, you know, do his thing. So I beat him. So now, when I press X, the um it's gonna hop straight into the cutscene. So yeah, I had to quit out the game because I didn't think I would be able to beat him really. Cause I only um challenged, I went back to fight him again only for the sake of you know damage checking, right? Cause I wanted to make do a damage check to ensure that um what was it to ensure that I was doing damage. That's the only reason I went back to fight him. And I killed him by complete accident. It wasn't even my intention to knock him out. But I'm about to hit the X button and we're about to get right into it. So you ready? Hopefully my um, explanation was enough for you to understand. Bailu healing is Bailu's good, but I just like Links more because Bailu healing is random. Oh, okay. <clears throat> but anyway, um, so you, so you ready? You got all that? You understand my situation? What happened? I want to make sure you um understand everything before I hit the X button.
You do? Cool. All right. We about to hop right into it. So, three, two, one, let's go. I'm gonna hand a little bit because it's hot. Okay, he's about to hop straight into a cutscene. So. This is crazy. He about to drop coins on everybody. <laughs> Isn't this a domain expansion? Right. Oh, I gotta put the autoplay on. Hold up. I see your comment. Give me one second. Gotta move this notification stuff out of the way. I saw my girl happy. Oh. <clears throat> I saw my girl happy silver wolf in someone else's live stream. JK, she is my girl. Is not. <laughs> oh, cool. Hopefully, she comes over and we can have a more enjoyable Friday live stream. They aren't in the dream. I'm afraid the family will not open the doors for you. Why? Because the path you walk is not accepted by the heart. Even if that's not what I want. Precisely because it's not what you want. Because they are not like other beings. They have never glanced at anyone, and they never need to. They leave woven strands of fate for humans to walk, and together, they leave a great shadow. And this shadow silently envelops them. I see your comment. <clears throat> Did you like the sus and weird things me and Silver Wolf was talking about in your live stream? Oh, I have no problem with it. <clears throat> yeah, I got no problem with it. I mean, cause it's just online back and forth banter. So. They have to, genuinely. <laughs> He's throwing cash at everybody. Is she moving faster than everybody else? I wish to know the departed. I swear, if Adventuring dies right here, I'm gonna be sad. Cause he don't deserve to die. Not here, of all places. No.
You better not get killed off like this. She destroyed his domain expansion. They can only get away with this doing inside of a dream, genuinely. The damage she just did, she would probably destroy a whole city block like this. And all in one move. Don't tell me you're dead, bro. <laughs> Please, don't kill this nigga off. He don't deserve to die. What is this place? He got clapped? Please don't tell me this happened. A gigantic black hole. And see. Have I succeeded? Nigga, you got succeeded into getting clapped. Just well, black hole. I don't believe that. He bet. I don't believe that, bro. If I find out this man has died already, I'm gonna say this right now. Honkai Star Rail doing too much now. <laughs> if I find out we got a more character, all these playable characters just dying off left and right, left and right, I'm gonna be like, okay, we need to stop doing this now. <laughs> Let's continue. My boy is cooked. He's in the abyss for crying out loud. I'm not gonna hold you, this is pretty tough. I hope I see something like this in Genshin Impact. Granted, I think I've seen something similar to this inside Genshin Impact in a domain or whatever we explored in the story at some point, I can't remember. But this is wild. Welcome to the Oh, yo. My boy is just running into the abyss. You came out alive after two days. It proves that you are the real deal. What are you gonna do now? Now that you've done the story? Oh, obviously I'm still gonna play it, obviously, because I still got other story content to do. Remember? I still got um, limit time story quests. I got like two of them still to do. I still got like that mu museum stuff to do. And probably, and of course I gotta do like, of course I wanna do like the um, combat related content too. I'm gonna live stream doing that stuff too. At some point. Well, well I can still do that while I gradually build my characters, of course. <laughs> but that's all in due time, but of course. Granted, next week, I'm telling you this right now, next week, Probably Wednesday or probably Thursday, I will be live streaming Genshin Impact. I hope you are, will be there to see that. Because one, I will be wishing for, um, um, what's her name? Um, uh, 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 Arlecchino. There we go. Boom. Woo. Dude simulated universe. I want to see you get wrecked. Psh, no problem. I got it. Shoot. If we can finish this story out before, um, before one o'clock. Yeah. Well, that's how I I'll hop in simulated universe and do it. Well. The Nihility envelops everyone equally. I don't like watching Genshin, but I might be here. Cool. I appreciate it. I appreciate the honesty. Because, one, I, what, I, what I will be doing when it comes down to Genshin, um, I will be, like, exploring the new location. And, of course, I will be doing um, Sino's second story quest because there's a new character that's arriving in it and whatnot. And I'm, inter I'm just interested in lore stuff and like exploring the new location because I love um, theory lore videos. I just love it. Can you guess what I'm doing today? Probably playing Honkai Star Rail or you're pro probably playing a different game. Or, or, hypothetically, 
You could have been in the middle of choking the chicken. Hopefully you understand what that reference means. Only some who have gone under their shadow can go farther, tainting themselves with more naivety. That's all. I do. Did you mean to say I was? Wait, let me get back to this real quick. It's, but, but I was just looking at Clara, cute face, and Alcron belly button. <laughs> Julian! <laughs> Bro, <laughs> I never get tired of talking to you. I swear I don't. What she just said about the whole concept of this nihility stuff. Nihility stuff consumes and taints you. That's very interesting. So it's not like the abyss and Genshin Impact. Well, okay, never mind. It is similar to the abyss and Genshin Impact. Because the abyss, if I remember correctly, it does taint you and changes you and even transforms you. So it's like, could the Nihility just be like the Abyss? Because everything gets engulfed in the Abyss. Granted, I know you don't, you stopped playing Gideon Impact, so you probably not caught up with the story and whatnot, which is fine. I'm just like talking out my ass. Well, for anyone who does still play it, who might come watch it, they'll understand what I'm talking about. Oh, so you did understand the reference. Okay, cool. I was just seeing if you were going to understand it or not. That's all. <laughs> and also, this is also an interesting thing. This is all but a fleeting dream. So did she kill this nigga or not? At this point, tell me, it's a fleeting dream. Until we, we just momentarily link here before we just move on to other paths. That sounds like taking this man to death. It seems that my death has already been determined. Even if you wish for it, I can't promise you anything. Now that you've accomplished your goal, I think you can be a little more forthcoming. I'm not gonna hold you, bro. Alcron giving me um God of War vibe right now. She got the ashy white skin, the red crimson paint all over her body and whatnot. Shoot, I won't be surprised if she was like, oh, I'm Kratos' daughter from um, God of War, and I've been traveling from world to world, and I finally arrived here in Honkai Star Rail, face ass. <laughs> she is a demon. You're right, she is a demon. <laughs> what do you mean? Your performance at the theme park was wonderful and grandiose. A simple, a simple yet practical, practical technique, technique that fooled almost everyone. everyone. No, no one would have ever thought that you would have gone to such lengths. Even staking your life just to prove a fact that had seemingly been disproved long ago. Real death does not exist in Penacomi's dreamscape. <laughs> Why would I do this? Okay. At least now I understand that the concept of the actual actually dying does not exist in the dreamscape. Boom. That answer that question is answered, so I know the mythology of that. And you know, Firefly is alive, basically. Boom. In my face. Because, because this, this is, is the, the only way you can uncover a secret that is even more unspeakable than the serial murders. To use this dream death to get there. To that, that promised land, land people constantly, constantly seek in this grand gathering. Wait a minute. My brain clicking. Don't even answer what I'm about to say right now. My brain is clicking. So, I what she just said just now. Does this mean that in order for you to reach the truth of what the whole grand, 
behind the whole dreamscape, the truth behind the dreamscape, you have to die. You have to die in the dream in order to reach it. Yo, what's up, J -L J L W? What's up, my guy? You missed it. You missed my explanation about earlier. So I'll give you a quick rundown um, about um, how I defeated um, Aventurine. Basically. I leveled up my characters to level 60, leveled up their talents to at least level 5. I accidentally leveled up Natasha's ultimate to level 6, but in the long run, that saved my life, and I was able to beat um, Aventurine, and I defeated him yesterday by accident, because I only went to fight him to, you know, use, use him as a damage check to see how much damage I was doing, and I, I killed him in his second phase, so yeah, that's how we're here. I really wanted to show y'all my, you know, my game, my game skills, you know, my my 100 IQ gamer tag level skills. Appreciate, appreciate the celebration. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Man, I'm not talking. I can't even talk right now. Jesus Christ. I'm talking so fast. My brain not working. Did you pull adventuring? No, I don't have enough to pull them. I, hopefully, I get them within 60 pulls. But for the next, like, what, two weeks, I'm just going to be harvesting, um these jades and if necessary i will spend probably five dollars at max in order to get like at least a 10 pull but if i fail to get them now i'm just gonna have to take that l honestly anyway let's continue Pinnacle, the legacy of the watchmaker the true land of exile called it Freaking predicted it. I called it. Knew it. How did, How did you find out? out? I, I never imagined that something I learned about unexpectedly would become the key, key to connecting everything. everything. It's, it's our, our stellar friend's, friend's, friend's identity, identity, isn't it? I, I see, see you're in the now. Let's, Let's just say, say I put money on the possibility. possibility. The, the murder isn't, isn't nearly enough, enough to disrupt business as usual. usual. Even if there were one or two murders in the Pentecomi, most people wouldn't be personally affected. And that won't create any waves. This dream of theirs isn't a boundless sea. It's a lonely island. The family used the harmony to build a high wall and isolate them from the vast and treacherous ocean of the outside world. That barrier they built keeps death out. But it also keeps the secrets that are lost in that watery abyss from floating to the surface. In a beautiful dream, free of suffering, who would want to go fishing for those secrets? No one. Among us. Mmm, I love this talk that I'm hearing. I can't help but compare it to Genshin Impact lore. I know I keep saying this and chat my head off, but I love Genshin's lore. I do, and I keep hearing all this talk that's like this, and all I can think of, bro, what the freak is inside the abyss? I need to know. Genshin Impact need to go ahead and release Dainsliff's freaking story quest, or Dainsliff, um, the the Dainsliff story quest. At this point, it's about to be a whole nother, a whole year is about to pass, and we still have not have gotten his Dainsliff quest at all. We're already in 4.6. We got 4.7 and 8 to go before 4.5 roll out the doorstep. At this point, 4.7 better be crazy. I done heard 4.7 gonna have, what, um, what is it, a new a spiral abyss so that it can give you actually difficult content. So if that's the case, a story quest better be tied to that. I'm so tired of waiting. I'm ready for my Dainsliff quest. I'm ready for more lore. Give it up already. <laughs> Yeah, I know this is a black hole, but I can't help but think of the, the abyss in Genshin. I just can't help but think of it when I see it. My bad, I'm just chatting y'all heads off, but like, I'm frustrated. <laughs> they taking way too long to give me my Dane's Lift quest. Unless someone goes to the other side of the barrier. Exactly. Uh. Someone already has. I got, I got the, the idea, idea early on, on chewing on that masked mask fool's little hint. If, if a mute isn't someone who cannot make a sound, 
then it has to be someone who cannot speak. Yeah, I wanted to know about this the bits as well. Exactly my point, bro. I swear, I feel I got this strange feeling that Honkai Star Rail is going to be like, it's going to have lore in it that's going to help me understand Genshin lore even more so in relation to like beyond the world of Tevat. Because at this point, I done came across a theory last night, a theory video last night that proclaims that the the um, Honkai Star Rail universe play, is still playing by the, well, the Genshin universe is playing by the same rules of the Honkai universe, right? Because the whole concept of the whole imaginary and the quantum power that exists in Genshin Impact, which I believe it does. I hope that everyone who does not use elemental power, like Skirk, um, Dainsliff, even the Abyss Twin, I hope they're all using quantum power and that the sustainer heavenly principles and the rest of the, you know, heavenly principles and the primordial one uses imaginary power. I hope so, because it's going to be crazy. It will be crazy, genuinely. I'm just saying. I can't wait. I can't wait till we like. Granted, we got like what two more years. We got Natlin and says Naya. Then we have Conrail, but we don't know when Conrail is gonna actually drop because what was it? Um, they blurred out the chapter number, so we don't actually know when Conrail will drop. The Genshin oh, rewards go into the. <laughs> Ah, oh my goodness. You're right. They all go into the abyss, and it's sad. It truly is sad. All the Genshin... All, I'm going to say this right now. Every reward that's supposed to be in Genshin, they all fell into the abyss and arrived in Honkai Star Rail. That's why Honkai Star Rail got so much extra rewards in it. All the rewards in Genshin fell into the abyss and made it here. That's what happened. That's why they suck. Exactly. That is why they suck. And it really does suck. I'm going to say this right now. I got 47 pulls for a, um, Arlequino. If I do not get a Arlequino within 47 pulls, despite the fact I am guaranteed to get her, I'm gonna be upset. Anyway, let's continue. I'm chat. I'm done chatting. Someone who survived the treacherous deaths, but is unable to take the stage and speak the truth. <laughs> well, I'm happy to know she's safe and sound, and still on Pentagon. Hit. Is that not proof? Well, proof is the one thing I don't have. The only thing that can prove these... ...conjectures... ...is for the family to come clean. And with the way they buttered up these outsiders, it seems pretty clear they're intent on covering their tracks. But you don't need proof to have a suspicion. And for me, suspicion is enough. I didn't, I didn't need to, to find the memories of me. I just needed for someone to kill me like it killed that silver-haired girl. Well, Julian, you could always build pity for Fushuan by trying to pull a venture in. Oh, never mind. Y'all in the midst of y'all conversation. Never mind. Just ignore what I said. You don't sound very confident to me. Going out of your way to make citywide broadcasts in an attempt to involve more people. You are simply betting on the possibility of someone being able to break down the barrier. You're very lucky that fate has decided to let us cross paths. I happen to be equipped with a very sharp blade. Sharp enough to slice through the veil of dreams. I can also carve the Harmony's brand off of you. You possess great cunning, deliberately setting us up to be on opposing sides, constantly repeating the words of the emanator in front of others, leaving me no choice but to draw my blade against you. Oh, she sound upset. She don't like the fact that she was gaslit by adventuring. <laughs> I would tell her too bad. My boy too smart. <laughs> he know how to play the game. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Simple. Just like Paimon, 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 and you will get it because Paimon is food and you need to feed the characters. Emergency food. Oh, hold on. Let me see this. Let me say this real quick. I don't know if y'all subscribe to like any Genshin Thor, um, theory lore videos. So let me hit y'all. Let me get, let me hit y'all with this real quick. So I came across, this was about, I think probably two weeks ago now. Um, Ashikai, the like one of the number one Genshin Impact theory, theory, um, crafters for Genshin Impact. She had made a theory in relation to the Traveler and Paimon, 
or more more accurately towards Paimon, saying that Paimon may be a necessary thing for the traveler in order for the traveler to ascend to godhood. And essentially, the conclusion was this: basically, the traveler will have to devour Paimon in some sort of some sort of form or fashion in order to be able to access their ascension into divinity. That's basically what the conclusion of her theory was. You can go watch it for yourselves to get a more um, in-depth detail um, explanation to how she got to that point. But, like, it made sense to me. Because if y'all played the um, Fontaine story quest, you know how um, the Narwhal, right? The Narwhal did not come from Tevat, right? It came into Tevat, and it was inside the Primordial Sea. And it kept devouring the Primordial Sea so much so that it essentially became a transcendent being, honestly. And it and it became a part of the primordial sea, right? So playing by that same logic, if tr if the traveler were to devour Paimon, and it's already been confirmed in like a world quest that Paimon has like a thread or a string connected to her, and it leads all the way up to the sky. So by the same logic, if the traveler were to devour Paimon or to absorb Paimon into them into their being, at some point in the game in the future. The traveler would be able to become a transcendent being and be able to achieve godhood. Boom. Simple as that. Okay, I'm done talking your head off. All right, looking to you. And that's how you win. Opportunity and strategy both are essential. And in your plans, the IPC always wins. Even if you lose the bet to the family. The life of an ambassador is still invaluable. That's a huge camel, isn't it? But allow me to point out a mistake. The IPC's success is not guaranteed. I, unfortunately, have no contingencies for such an important matter. Detonating a stellar bomb. I can't do it. The adventuring stone is too broken to even safeguard my escape from the stage. If, at the end of the day, you did not unsheath your blade, I would have lost the bet. It is pointless to discuss what ifs. You have won. Your prize is an entry ticket into that deep sea. And after this, whether you can return from the abyss is another gamble of yours. Have you never wavered? Wavered? <laughs> of course I have. But I can only bank on my own good fortune. Well, if adventuring will would be fine, then it won't hurt if you win him. Pushon is awesome. Because other than that, I have nothing. Wake up from this dream and go to where you should be. Your gamble. Is not over yet. <sighs> Before we part, can you answer one more question? As someone who has traveled on that road, can you tell me why are we born into this world? If it's just to die. I don't think this and never have. Nor do you. But the nihility envelops you and I. And everyone. And because of that, it's pointless. But it is still there. If the dice of fate are always weighted, then that is our destiny. Why, then, do we struggle against it? My answer might not be able to resolve your confusion, because it has been with you throughout your journey and is already a part of your life. But you said sleep is the rehearsal of death. So why does life sleep? Because we are not ready to welcome death. So you can definitely understand why we want to be prepared. 
Mm, what a lovely answer. I respect that answer. Nobody ready to die yet. Let's be honest. Even right now. I'm not even thinking about death right now. Because it's like, I can't focus on it right now. I can't. I genuinely can't. I can't waste time of my life focusing on dying because of XYZ. I gotta keep pushing. The only death I'm gonna experience is my rehearsal of it, which is called me going to sleep. <laughs> Shoot. The only type of death I want is to die in my sleep. And I wanna be an old man when that comes. Even, Even if the, the ending has been predetermined, pre that's fine. There are, there are countless, countless things that humans cannot change. But before the end, there are many things that humans can do while on their journey. Exactly. And because of this, the end will thus reveal a completely different meaning. It sure will. Shoot. It ain't about the destination, it's about the journey for real. Shoot. You're going to accept death wholeheartedly if you was able to live your life fully the way you wanted to. Shoot. You're going to be like, huh, finally, it's time to kick the bucket. I'm tired. It's finally time for me to go to sleep permanently. Take a good look at your pocket. Your friend has already given you the answer. Good luck. Hold up. I see what you said, Julian. Let me take a look at what you said. I will be happy. Hold up. The impossible in the dreamscape is not death, but rather dormancy. Do stay alive. I wish you the best of luck. Doctor's advice. I will be happy. Okay, this is from Julian. I will be happy if I am dead. If I died by Akron's hands. She just need to give me some more <coughs> Julian 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 my brother Julian <laughs> you never cease to amaze me shoot I'm not gonna hold you wait didn't I say what I forgot my list I'm probably gonna make my list later never mind whatever let's continue <laughs> then I shall get it going. Mister, you're leaving? You ultimately chose to leave this dreamscape? Yes. Because they are not here. My papa, mom, and big sis. Then where are they? They are in a place where everyone will go. A very, very distant place. You know what's interesting? I just had this realization. It feels like adventuring was the main character of this entire story of Pentaconi. He feels like he was the main character. Not the Trailblazer, not Alcron, or no one else. He has been the main character of this entire, entire plot line. Since when we first met him, all the way till now. I just had that realization. I just had it. Which is interesting to do because, granted, I'm still a little confused about stuff. I'm still a little confused about how they telling their story and whatnot. Because even with Bellabog, right? On um, Jurilo 6, I think, right? It feels like the main character of that story was Branya. So if they're doing this type of storytelling for each place we go to, right? Then it's gonna make sense for them to be for them to do the whole oh, the Astro Express go from place to place helping out whatever you can. So boom, that means our crew of characters do not need to be focused on as the main characters for X, Y, Z. Seems like it, but he might be absent due to going into what that black hole. Yeah. I swear, if he dies, I'm still gonna be upset. I hope he doesn't die and he comes back from the abyss. Then are you going to? I'll get there one day. 
but not now. There, there will come a day when the sky will drizzle, and, and I will hear the call of Gaiath for Triclops. Know that it is time for me to go, and be reunited with my family. I doubt he dies? Bro, <laughs> did you forget what title this is? Kakolia, she died. She had a whole character design. She got cooked, packed up. Um, what's her name? Ting Yoon. I'm gonna believe she's dead until proven otherwise. She packed up and out of here. You think they went and clapped him too? This is the Honkai verse or the Honkai reality story storylines. They will kill everyone off. Kakolia isn't a character. Well, she is a character, but she's not a playable character, which, in my opinion, really sucks. Because she had a gorgeous character design. For them to kill her off the way they did without making her a playable character is wild to me. Honestly. Honestly, it's wild to me. Because they could have just killed off an NPC that had a unique character design. Genuinely, they could have just replaced her with an NPC. But instead, they gave her a whole character design. Shoot, I would have pulled for her character. Who? You gonna... Gonna, I'm gonna like the next scene? Shoot. We about to see. I'm about to continue. And JL, you can answer um, what Julian asked about. So, until that time comes, I should be preparing. Respectfully. Preparing for what? To be put in a coffin. I'm preparing to face them, Kakasha. And to make them proud. Mm. I know, I know you'll, you'll be, be able, able to, to do, do it. it. Good luck. <laughs> well, of, of course. course. For, For I am a child who received the blessing of Gaiathra Triclops. <laughs> but you still seem nervous. Yeah, that is what I'm asking or what I'm theorizing. Cause more than likely, I'm I'm clean to believe that he will get capped off. <laughs> JL, I'm gonna say this right now. Julian, Julian probably messing with you. Because he plays this game. Ain't no way he don't remember. <laughs> See, he messing around with you. <laughs> J See JL? That's what I'm talking about. He messing around with you. He know what you're talking about. <laughs> he being goofy on purpose. <laughs> he play Honkai Star Row. I seem that way because I am nervous. You know what? Maybe you can help. What do you say? One last time? Put our palms together. That boy is ugly, Jesus! His head shape is wild. I do not like how he animated it. Keeping your blood eternally pulsing. May your journey be forever peaceful. Your schemes forever concealed. Our paths will cross again beneath Kakala's shimmering auroras. That man stepping into the quantity of the abyss. I hope he traveled into the abyss. I want him to be a unique character that ends up rolling in um, freak. Oh my goodness gracious. I, something just clicked in my brain. Hold up. Something wild just happened in my brain. What if Skirk from Genshin Impact, right? What if she's from Honkai Star Rail? Like, I'm just throwing, throwing it to the wind right now. What if she's from Honkai Star Rail and she managed to travel to the Genshin world? And blah, 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 right? And then she meets up with the dude called Sertology and then she ends up training child. Genuinely. I know this is just a crack theory in my brain right now, but <laughs> just let me cook. It, it's just really connecting my brain cells right now. I just realized that. Granted, it's still a theory. But I would love it for, be, that, be, for that to be the case. I would. 
because people was complaining about her character design, talking about some, oh, she look like a Honkai character, mm, she don't look like a Genjin character, all I could think was, shut up, nigga, dang, we got a new character with such a unique design in comparison to every character in Genjin Impact, the only characters in Genjin Impact that rival her design is the Traveler, Dane's Lift, and that's it, generally, because we don't have a lot of characters who look like they're from beyond Tevat. Anyway, that's enough of my rant. Let's continue. Also, I'm going to say this. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to believe Julian is joking with you until proven otherwise. So there's more to happen in the next update then. That's what this sounds like to me. Ooh, a fourth person has arrived. I come to fill love, and I come to claim. I bestow poison in the guise of sweet dew. Come the toil of spring and yield of fall. I patiently wait for the branches to be heavy with withered fruits. Uh, whoever the fourth person is who came, who arrived, yo, what's up? Welcome to the stream. All for the Amber Lord. Excuse you? No way. Is all these people worshiping the god of destruction in this universe? You try to open your eyes, but you find only blindness. Where is this? What happened? Whose point of view is this? Whoa, what? The indescribable force severs the power of preservation while time and space froze instantly. Your thoughts twist into a knot as your senses fail, with only gravity tearing at your mind as you plummet into boundless darknesses. It's, wait, hold on. Is that supposed to imply that the trailblazer lost his ability to tap into the power of the preservation? Is this what this means? Until a fire engulfed you in his embrace. Yes, I'm Kalamesh. I think someone saved me. Doesn't matter. I need to get out of here. I doubt it. Yeah, it probably, you know, it probably just confirmed that that probably didn't happen with this line right here. I think someone saved me. And you are? Just what's happening here? It's you. What have you done? I didn't do anything but wait for you to wake up. You've met me before. I'm Sam, a stellar hunter. Yes, and unfortunately, I know your identity already. <laughs> Which is the sad part, really. I blame people on YouTube who don't know how to stop spoiling stuff. And I'm not talking about y'all in the chat. I'm going to make that clear. I'm not talking about y'all. I'm talking about people on YouTube who don't know how to stop posting Sam spoilers. But can't really blame them because they're under the pretext that everybody played the story quest. 
So I can't really be too upset about them. But it's just like, gah! I wish you didn't plan on showing up earlier to reveal some truths to you. But I encountered more roadblocks than expected. Eleven times I've tried, but ended in failure. Before I knew it, this world and I became too intertwined, and it became too difficult to escape the constraints of the script. Elio was right. In this land of the dreams, you and I will reap unforgettable gains. I don't know people's hearts as well as he and Kafka do, nor do I have a specialty like Silver Wolf and Blade. Most of the things that I'm good at only apply to villains who need no mercy. That sounds like a pretty good skill, in my opinion. Also, JL. Going all in on Sam unless they leak five star March seventh by then. Hey. Shoot, all I know is this. If I don't get adventuring before these four weeks are up, or now three weeks, because this week is technically get technically over. So now I got three weeks. Uh, if I don't get him within three weeks, I'm gonna say I'm gonna save my wishes for the next character in the next update. Honestly. I'm just gonna have to do that, honestly. I probably, I probably, I will probably, most likely pull for Robin. So, there is only one method that I use. Okay. This is to show you. Oh, that I hear. Did she drink something? What was that? To be continued? That's crazy. Are you serious? You're not been like No! Hold up! Traps everywhere? The owner of this mansion must be a bit paranoid. No. No, 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 no. We're not doing this. Absolutely not. No. I'm not continuing this. How dare they show her you know, look like she's drinking something that allowed for her to transform the way that she did. <laughs> and it's like, oh, you don't get to walk, you don't get to do this. No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. I'm, I'm upset. <laughs> I'm genuinely upset. I can't even think straight. Hold up, I gotta collect my thoughts. Cause, oh my goodness. Okay. So, she got some high-tech suit on, but it burns out in fire with something she's carrying on her body. And it looks like it etches into her skin, so much so it's digging into her nerves. You can fight Sam in current level 11 MOC. Okay. That's good. That's cool to know. Okay, hold up. Whew. I gotta get my brain together. Julian, I'm right. I'm I'm with you on your sentiment because they better return back to that scene because I want to know. <laughs> you are so funny, Mr. Security Officer. I hope that sense of humor of yours has helped you find the serial killer. Just expressing a personal opinion. Why did I hit a nerve, Mr. Gallagher? My patience is wearing thin. Neglecting duties will only make me more suspicious that you and the real serial killer are connected. <sighs> Scoundrel, punk, drunk, hooligan. I have heard this trash talk all too often, but I have never once thought that I'd be treated as an accomplice to a murderer. Oh. He ain't like that. Somebody about to get their shit ran for real. I ain't gonna hold you. Um, Angel Boy be talking too crazy. He been acting a little wild and out of place, honestly. 
He shoot. He about to get his shit ran by Galfer. Talking heavy. He about to get jawed in the mouth for real. I, I take back what I said. Your problem is paranoia. You're just crazy, you know, lunatic. No, oh, we getting into it. I like it. Oh, you said JK? I thought you was being serious. Cause I really wanted to um show off my um what I did to beat him. Shoot. I was really excited if I had to fight him in um MOC again. You, the family, you broke my spine and pulled out my fangs, and now you wanna accuse me of murder? Ridiculous. Only idiots who've drunk too much soul glad will berate a stray dog in the streets. What exactly is making you say all this nonsense? You should be more concerned about the outworld visitors who are making a scene in the theme park than me. I don't need you to remind me. Once that ambassador walks through the doors of the mansion, I will know what he wants. My servants see everything. His little magic tricks may have fooled me, but no matter, I'm happy to see how it's turned out. Okay, so those birds are his. Okay. I thought those birds belonged to um Black Swan. That's what I thought. Why do you think that I just let him go? And why do you think I emptied the theme park stage? Because my target from the beginning has always been you. Hound. The more noise he makes. The more opportunities I have to make you and your true master pay in blood. Ooh, we talking crazy. Okay, so J, uh, you're telling me I can fight. Uh, um, I for sure can fight him in MOC 12. And Julian, you're telling me that I can fight him again in Forgotten Hall, but I might not get that far because it's kind of hard and your team's still kind of weak. Bro, you, you don't, you just haven't seen my team yet to even call it weak. The fact that I, may, I was able to clap him off screen before by accident proves I got it. <laughs> I got it in the bag. I'm going to show you. Too. I just got to build like another team of characters, then I'm good to go. If I were really the murderer, why would you need to be so secretive? Ha! Huh, I forgot. Oh. You also have a difficult master to serve. Telling you to ignore the murder case and focus solely on that Charmony Festival. You're right, my bad. I forgot. I forgot it was called, um... Forgotten Hall is the MOC. I have a hall... Wait, I have a hand in Forgotten Hall? No, hold on, hold on. I have a hard time in Forgotten Hall, and I got level 80 characters. I'm going to assume that's what that said, 80. Cause let me hit, hold up, give me a second. Don't even press nothing. Yep, I called it. Boom, I got it right. I'm such a genius. Is that right, my brother? Whoa, what? <sighs> Looks like your disguise has helped you successfully understand every facet of the family. His brother. Skies? You must be blind to be accusing me of being a fake. Open your eyes and take a good look. Indeed, every part of you is real. The brown hair, soft and curly like Benny's. The orange eyes, which make me miss the gaze of Sir Whitaker. That odd scar. The mark of Wolsey. And the gray vest, tie, hound emblem, bottle, the bartending, and your role as a security officer. These are all true traits from all 52 loyal family members. When they are gathered, countless tiny truths are woven together into a lie. You collected a small piece of each of them and claimed them for yourself. Then you invented this facade, a complete Gallagher. Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> you have guts, I'll give you that. Not bad. I severely underestimated you. What? 
had her. But so what? Can this prove that I murdered your sister and then stole away? This proves that you and the Memory Zone mean death are linked. And that's enough. Listen up. I don't care how you did it. I only care about one thing. The answer to a question. Okay, okay. So it seems my boy Sunday does not know that she could that his sister didn't die. Cause you can't die in the dream, as they explained. You can't die inside the dream. You can only be sent to the I guess the black void or to wherever the truth is of Pentacone. You can only be sent there. So he doesn't know that. So he's assuming that his sister is out of here. Gone. Kaplui turned to dust. An animation, yes. <laughs> you know, in the thick of things, people are blind to the grit in their eyes. Yet they can always feel it scratch. Want the answer? I'll give it to you. <laughs> The whole thing is just fate playing a cruel joke on us. Homeboy got snuck up on. Oh my goodness great. Oh shoot, I got me a cool um four star um light cone as well. Also, let me continue. Homeboy got snuck up on like crazy. <laughs> the sneak nation is going bizarre crazy right now. <laughs> this is what I was talking. <laughs> <laughs> Homeboy got caught lacking. He was sitting here upset. Why you kill my sister? They got stabbed in the back without even realizing it. <laughs> well, it supposedly showed her dead in her clam thing in real life. Really? We was in real life at that point? I could have sworn we were still inside the dreamscape by at that point though. I may have to go look back at it again and see. Or maybe that was Sparkle playing as dead Ooh, hold up, that could be also That also could be true. What characters did you use? The light cone is good on Blade if you do pull for him when he comes back. Oh, I'll show you the team I use. Give me a second. This really sucks. Stay tuned for the next upcoming installment. Bro, I will not play this game for five months straight if that means I get five months worth of story content. Honestly. Because I know, um, freaking, what is it? I can play the limited time event story quest stuff whenever I want to. Shoot, I will legitly stop playing this game for five months if I have to. To get so much story. And I gotta wait like everybody else. Look at these two bad bitches. Oh my god. In the role of Helmmaster, it's rare that I have the chance to gaze upon the stars like this. It should be a view I tire of seeing, but it always leaves me in awe. The heavens really are boundless. What do you think of this place? Thank you. I like it. Oh, hold on. I, hold on. Let me say this real quick. Let me say this real quick. Mm -mm -mm. What I find very interesting is that. If, you know in Genshin Impact we have the Serena Teapot, right? But the Serena Teapot is not used for any story related stuff at all. But the, the Astral Express is like one of the main story piece things that we have. And they allow playable characters to come in and be like, Oh shoot, your um this train looks awesome. Can I I'm gonna kick it around here for a little bit, right? And it feels so much more important than the freaking Serenity Teapot. It's like Shoot, why won't Genshin just use the Serenity Teapot in the story mode to be like, hey, I'm going to come roll over to your um teapot after the story quest and be like, oh, your place looks nice, bro. Like, come on. It's a 
shame. The stars no longer belong to me. Perhaps one day I shall feel their embrace once again. But it will undoubtedly be the day of my last flight. Come and have a look whenever you can. I will. Thank you for your invitation. I can't help but say that after arriving on the express, I'm a little envious of your way of life. You are able to enjoy the vastness of the universe with reliable companions by your side. I hope you won't cherish one another. Oh, look at that. We finished it right before 10 o'clock here. I can't help but say that... I'm not talking to you right now. Something the matter? Okay, never mind, forget it. Is there someone else in here? Oh, they go well over there. He this dummy all the way over here. Is there anything you'd like to share with me? Never mind, forget it. Okay. So I sh I don't know wait, hold up. Let me show let me see. Let me see if I can get the team up so I can show y'all. Where is the team that I use? Boom, here. Nope, that's not it. That's not it either. No. Where is the team I used? Okay, so let me just straighten this out. Okay. Boom. This is the team I used, right here. This is how I beat um, Adventuring. I'm gonna show y'all once I get off the train. Let me see, where can I go? Oh, here we go, boop. Let's pop it right on over there. This haven of memories. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all what I did. Okay, everybody on the team is level 60. Boom. Okay, so her light cone is level 40, which probably is the reason why she dropped to the floor first when we got to the latter half of phase two. Because I was trying to level this up, but I only brought her in as a damage check. So I can see what I was doing, but I ended up killing the dude. Okay, so that's level 40. Her traces are level five for at least three of them. Level two base attack. Relics, not the best, but it didn't matter because we still clapped them. Eidolons, she got two of them. So let's go to Alcaron. Alcaron level 60, you see her stuff, da 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 yada. Light cone, level 60. Why did you kill the dude? <laughs> I killed him by mistake. I ain't knew I was gonna be able to win. <laughs> Alcaron, she got her basic attack level three, her skill, ultimate, and talent level five. Relics, of course, blah, 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 10, 10, 10, it's two, six. Eidolon one, Herta, interesting enough, level 60 light cone, level five, Talent, level 5 ultimate, level 6 skill, level 4 basic. What did he do to you? Well, he did to me. He disrespected me from constantly hitting me with his, um, what was it? All or nothing? Well, he got the all or nothing and got killed himself. <laughs> That's what he did. He disrespected me. Relics, level 10, except for the two in the middle. Eidolons, three Eidolons. What else did I do? And finally, Natasha... Level 60, light cone, and I think this is what ended up saving me in the end, because this was supposed to happen. I was I was going to level up the skill, ultimate, and talent all to level 5, right? But I, miss, I messed up and didn't pull the stick forward, and I accidentally leveled up her ultimate two times. So I think because of that mess up, that slight mess up, I ended up surviving as long as I did. I got Esex Herta. Good for you, Julian. And the relics, yada yada, not the best. And Eidolons, none. So I managed to clap him with my level 60 team with only one member of the level 60 having a level 40 light cone. So <laughs> I clapped him by accident. <laughs> Shoot, man, I wish I were. I was thinking about live streaming right then and there. But I was like, I'm already in the latter half of the fight, and it's already like two o'clock, going on two o'clock in the morning. So I was like, Nah, I'm not gonna do that. 
But anyway, shoot, I hope I can find me something to fight. Because I've only been streaming for about like an hour, right? Hold on, let me... I know I started around 8.40. Let me, let me take a look. I've been streaming for, yeah, about an hour. This is going to be the shortest live stream. Use your farm. Eventually, look for her relics for a month. Okay, cool. Also, um, I know there is like some... What is it? What I'm thinking about. Um, tell me... Tell me the location of where um, Alcaron's relics are. Like, where are they located at? Are they in Panacone by any chance? Because I need to know where they at. Unless they're not in Panacone and they're on Jurilo 6. Because that's the only thing that makes sense. Because a lot of artifact sets are not here. Wait, what was that? Oh, this light cone stuff. The Reverie Dreamscape. Okay. The Reverie Reality, the Reverie Dreamscape. Okay, cool. So. That's not it. Oh, it's this one, right? Perfect. So, I'm going to go ahead. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and farm it right now. Wait, how much energy I got to even waste on it? Okay, I got 240 energy. So, also... Also, I think also another reason why I managed to um, beat uh, Adventuring was because I leveled up my stuff rather fast in comparison. Because I thought I was going to need till Monday to finish leveling all my characters up. But then I forgot I had this whole, you know, this, um, what, I forgot, I don't know what this thing called. This middle thing right here. Um, I used this yesterday. And I was able to farm for even longer. So, so yeah. I really, yeah, this fuel. I really love the fact that this system exists in this game. Because it's got three options of fuel. While in Genshin Impact, you only got, like, one option for fuel. No, you got two options. Which is your Primo Gems or the, the Moon Crystal thingies. Whatever it's called. Right? But, like, it doesn't even provide you enough fuel to be like, I can farm for five days straight. Oh, never mind. It's not that it doesn't provide you enough fuel. It's that you do not come across the whole that moon shaped currency a lot in the game. You have to do a lot of exploration to even get at least three pieces of that whole moon stuff, that moon shaped stuff, to then turn into the currency needed to farm in Genshin Impact, right? In this game, I done collected so much of this stuff without even realizing it. And that's what really sucks in Genshin Impact. But, um, yeah, so let me, you know, I'm probably going to add a little bit of that energy to it. Let me, let me, let me do something real quick. Uh, R3, there we go. Boom. But I'm going to look at, look at my little angel, Clara. <laughs> you go do you, my boy. I'll see you later in case you want to come back. Because I might... Well, I'm probably going to be just, like, trying to do the little bit of events and whatnot. Or, shoot, I might end the stream. I'll see what I'm going to do within the next hour. Within the next hour. I'll probably end the stream at 12 o'clock. Since we got everything done, I guess I'll just farm for a little bit. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, so I can't use it because my Trailblaze power is full. Okay. So let's go ahead and get started. I guess I'll do the, which one? I'll do this one, because I like having a harder challenge. Electro, I need to replace her off the team. Actually, no. Gwen Knifen, put you on here. Wind is here. Replace her with an Electro character. Who will it be? Hmm. 
I guess it'll be homegirl right here. Boom. Always do max level. What you mean? Like always like do like the highest level of difficulty? Yes? Okay, cool. The highest level is 56. So, let's go ahead and get to it. Okay. Oh, my Branya is weak. I can't bring her on the fight. So, I gotta replace her with Sampa. Boom. Alright, boom. Now we can get started. Only level 3? Yeah, that's the, that's the... Well, that's... Wait, hold up. Isn't that the furthest I have unlocked, though? I'm pretty sure level 3 is the, the furthest I have that's unlocked. I need to stop being weird and stop simping for twerp. <laughs> Bro, she is a fictional character. You're fine. <laughs> she is a fictional character. She is not real. She does not. You don't need to ask for permission or what. You don't even need to think about morality about fictional characters. They're fictional characters. I can imagine putting a bullet to Clara's head and pulling the trigger, and I'm not gonna think too much about it. What trouble blaze level are you? Oh, um. I'm, I think I'm level 50 at, right now. I'm still on level 50. You probably do need to do a lot of questioning. Hold up, let me say this. Hold up, let me turn my fan off real quick because it's blowing in my ear. Okay. Let me say this really quick. So I can go ahead and understand the thought process. Give me one second. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Can we bring out turn the my, my TV down a little bit. Okay. The only, I would agree that you probably need to do a lot of questioning about yourself, but it only can make sense in the context of this. When it comes down to, for example, the whole killing in video games, how people just like wave that off, right? When people wave that off and killing in video games, it's like, you, you can't get mad at the product for having that in the game, right? But if you already had a tendency to think that type of way, Hey, before you even encountered the what encountered the product in question the fictional product in question you can't blame the product you have to blame one yourself do quest yeah i probably do quest right now well after i farm this a little bit but like yeah like if you already had the tendency in your mind like mind you if you have like attraction to actual you know to whatever you have in real life. I'm not going to be explicit because, you know, I don't know how YouTube would clap me or whatever YouTube might do to me in case I'd be overly explicit. But if you already had, like, an attraction towards something before you even, like, like got into, like, lolly characters and anime or cool, you know, killing and anime or fight scenes or what, whatever it may be, or GTA or whatever, you can't blame the product. You have to look at yourself and blame yourself. Well, you have to blame the person, not the product, because the person already had that tendency. So, yeah, I have to get that out because my thought process is doing the way it's doing. Because me personally, I can't just jump to the conclusion that somebody is weird because they like lolly characters. Shoot, let's get on. If we really want to even play that game, like we can really talk about the furry community. I done seen, I done heard not even seen or heard but it's like i've come across a little bit of instances of hearing something about pedophilia going on with the furries at conventions and whatnot so it's pretty freaking wild to hear and even wilder to know that even that community has the gall to point at lollycon people who like lolly characters and think that they're weird it's like what did you look in the mirror today you're dressed as an animal walking on two feet <laughs> Boom. Hold up, the TV low? Hold on, let me crank it up a little bit. No way these niggas survived. Boom. 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 Clap. Next up. They're cooked. Boom, boom, boom. 
12k, let's go. To betray my customers, I charge extra. 9k. BS, he should have died. Corrected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom. Okay. Oh, so I don't really know. Oh, never mind. There's a quest I can go do right now. I can go unlock the whole rest of the um Forgotten Hall stuff. And I won. Let's see what I got. Are these all the same pieces? Hold up. Oh, hold up. Okay. I only got two pieces? And they're the same piece. No, I got... I got three pieces. So I gotta do it again. To betray my customers, I charge extra. Destiny for oblivion. Almost done. Hurry up and kill the damn thing. Finally. I weep for the part. She should do so much damage right now. Yep. 11k. That's not too bad. Bro. I'm so tired of this. If y'all don't kill these fools. No way. Ain't no way. Hold up. There we go. I weep for the part. Almost done. That's Almost there. To betray my customers, he's dead. I charge extra. Are you serious? Kill him! Thank you. Finally. Took forever. Anyway. I still got the same... Okay. Yeah, that's gonna take a while. That's gonna take a lot, a real long while. Hold on, what my Trailblaze level is right now? Oh yeah, I'm at Trailblaze level 50. I should be pushing on 51 or 52 at the moment. Okay, so I do have a quest I can go do, and it involves like it links. You got to look at the five star gear. Hmm, hold up, let me let me hit the inventory. Light cones, relics. Okay, okay. So here we go, right here. Yeah, these not it. Those not it. Those ain't it either. Yeah, I still didn't get a five star piece of what she needs but i did get the four star piece so i just gotta find where those are but i guess that one didn't matter so much unless you have ruan may <laughs> yeah and i'm kind of upset that i didn't play the game sooner when ruan may was here because from what i understand ruan may is a good character to use and she's a cryo character too so it's like oh my goodness Increases damage dealt to enemies with debuffs. Okay, so I got at least I have how many pieces of it? Wait, come on. Are you serious? I only have one piece? I should have no. Here you go. So I got like three star pieces, but I gotta still harvest for more. So we'll come back to this later. But there is a quest I can go do right now, if I remember correctly. Where is it? Um, uh, nope, that's not it. That ain't it. 
I can finally do this because now I unlocked. So I'll do that later. Here it is, right here. Just delete all those blues. I can't. I'm, well, I'm of course I'm gonna put them all into you know the relics so I can you know have material to use so I can you know fill my four star relics and five star relics. Whew, I feel like I can't talk. Jeez. Mm -mm. Salvage them. Yeah, I'm still trying to understand that salvage stuff. I didn't touch that yet. I'm going to wait till I understand that better. I'll probably search up a video about, about it later. Yes, I'm interested. It's the same as using them? Oh, okay. For upgrades. Oh. Okay, cool. I'll... I'll touch upon it later in the stream because I'm probably not going to end it probably till 12. So I'll touch upon it later and see how it go. But I got a quest we can do right now, which is this, which I think not salvaging them takes longer. Oh, okay. So it's a necessity to, to do that. Okay, cool. Now I'll, I'll do that later in the stream. For right now, we're gonna hop into this quest. Um, well, I'm gonna hop into this quest, bang it out, and then I'm gonna do the whole salvage thing and check check it out. Wherever there tempo. That's right. World quests aren't voice, are they? Doing the links quest? Question mark. Oh. Yeah, but wait, I'm pretty sure it's not voiced. I'm pretty sure it doesn't have any voicing in it. But I'm doing it so I can just collect an Eidolon. Because right now I have how many Eidolons of her? I have no Eidolons of Lynx. So you know, it'll be good to have the Eidolon. And also because I think it unlocks the rest of the old MOC as well by doing the quest. Hold on, let me double check. I'm pretty sure it unlocks the rest of it. Never mind. I don't think it unlocks the rest of it. I think I could be wrong. Hmm. Okay. I'll probably bang this out real quick. Yeah, might as well do that. Should help with level. Even to their deaths, you know what I mean? Do I know you, Hey, well, fragment of the language, yes, dude. okay. Uh, mm, Yeah, that's what it was. It unlocks the pure fiction, I think. I would love it if this thing was voiced. Now, some of his quests are voiced, but I would just love it if it just voiced it. Jeez, can they not, like, just voice all these world quests? I really don't want to skip it because it sounds like something interesting. But I got to skip all of it this is a super tiny quest but is like MOC okay go on Oh, we're starting. Oh, Pure Fiction. Pure Fiction is a series of highly difficult challenges and stages that are freshly regulated. Uh huh. And the game will image will continuously appear. You can earn points by dealing them. Oh, so it's a, like a constant wave of enemies until I finally die, right? This will help you get jades. Perfect. 
Once you clear perfection and earn points, you will receive story stars and story rewards. You see, hold up. We're not even gonna do that. You see Kakolia? You see her fine, amazing figure? It's like, why kill her off and not make her a playable character? We could have kept her around for a little longer. She didn't need to die. They could have just locked her up in an insane asylum at best. She's gorgeous, and she just had to be clapped and made into a boss instead. It's like, come on! I would love playing that, playing her as an ice character with these cheeks and hips all everywhere. You get what I'm saying, Julian. You understand. I know you do. We're on the same wavelength. Each phase is updated with a unique... With... What type of word? Whimsicality. I'm not even gonna pronounce that right. And blah, 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 blah. effect choose one for Okay. When allies use their ultimate attack and an enemy target inflicts damage with super with six times Okay. Six times. Okay. So L three. Okay. So, how do I select? Did I select it? Begin story. Please. Oh, so it's a story beat all the way through? That's interesting. Okay. Select four characters on your team. Oh boy. I might not make it. Okay, okay, okay. No, I got this, I got this. Dr. Ratio, he going on team one. Not a story, really? Oh. Team 2 is going to have Homegirl, but it's not letting me slide. Jeez. So, I need my healer. I'm probably going to bring... No, I'm not going to bring them. Who else do I need to bring? Okay, so I might bring... Hmm... Serval. And... Finally, my quantum character. It's just battles. Okay. Go to equip. Okay. Oh, so it's like this feels like some of the like limited time mini games or mini combat stuff that Genshin has, but this is just permanent. Because. I usually see this in Genshin when it comes down to their like limited time event stuff. Which is great to know that they made this stuff permanent. Hopefully Genshin does that in 4.7. Jesus Christ. I can't keep getting away with... Oh, we're not trying to make stuff for old players. We're trying to make things easier for new players. BS. And then they constantly keep making new stuff for new players. Trying to make things easier for them to understand stuff. Even easier for them to level up characters and whatnot. So it's like, you have to focus on difficult stuff at this point. You need to complete it every two weeks. Okay, so it is like spiral builds. Boom. Okay, so let me put my team two though. Okay, boom. Okay, so I'm bringing Alcaron. I'm bringing Trailblazer, Gwenifin, and finally, to top it all off, possibly. Oh, where's Lynx? Lynx. Then. We're gonna just do that one and enter story. This is gonna be fun. You learn to know yourself before your enemy. For the fear of a mediocre. Can't stop the run. Bring Pela instead of Lynx. All right, I'll do that. Give me a second. Let me go through all that. Okay, hold up. Should be easy anyway. Okay. Here to crash the party. Now I'm gonna just keep to you with this until um otherwise autoplay. You can fight it or rock with it. Next time. Hmm. 
too. Feel like I'm winning fast. Yeah, be no problem. I'll still be here. No way. Uh uh. We bet not. There we go. I know, um, yeah, I know about Herta being great in pure fiction. I I heard about that. I kept hearing that a lot before I started playing the game. So I was like, yeah, that's why I'm probably gonna build Herta the most. So I'm probably gonna be using her the most in pure fiction. I'm back. Yo, what's up, Julian? I'm doing the pure fiction. No freaking way. You can fight it or rock with it. Execute the Mara Struck. Oh my goodness. No! I messed up. Well, no, it's not that I messed up. I just didn't get, didn't get a lot of points. How was that? That's only 10,000? I didn't even reach 30,000. Storms on the horizon. Don't build her if you don't already have her built, though. You should put main focus on Alcron. Okay, cool. I think Al my Alcron is doing good right now. Until I like, change her artifact set, at least. Screen four. Yeah, she's doing pretty good, from what I'm saying. He's cooked. I weep for the part. It still shall fall. If you keep playing, you will be out damaging me in no time with Alcron. <laughs> Sounds good. Appreciate it. Thank goodness I brought my preservation because I think I've been clapping. Oh. That was a lot. We doing our thing right now. Let's freaking go. I weep for the part. No way about to kill one dude with this attack. It is a fall. Let me pause this right now. Let me read that. People stealing my Clara, Mommy Kafka, and Tingyu. I got thirteen thousand credits from it. I'm going to assume that's a pretty low amount of credits. Oh, are you? Oh, hold on. Let me correct myself. So this is okay. So people can use your characters even in pure fiction, right? That's how you can accumulate, you know, um, currency as well. Correct me if I'm wrong. 
Oh no. Destined for oblivion. Okay, never mind then. I thought that's how it worked. They gotta go. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Okay, so they can use them regular content and weekly bosses. Okay, that's good enough. Again, my team doing this thing right now. No! I no! I found. Oh, so I should use some with level eighty characters when I'm farming. Okay. It should be super easy when you get decent teams. I can't type LOL. <laughs> That's perfect. So what's about to happen is, oh, hold up. Wait a minute. Oh, I already claimed the character. Never mind. I'm so stupid. I forgot. That's how I originally got her in the first place. I claimed her character because I know. Let me double check that again. Never mind. I didn't unlock it. Never mind. So, I'm going to do that again. It says I got to do stage two. So, let me do this again. This time, Team 1 got to get changed up. So, who's in Team 1? I brought a Quantum character, which was pretty stupid of me to do. So, instead, I need to change it up with somebody else. I need to bring another Destruction character, and the only other Destruction character I got is Clara. So, Julian and Clara are going to have to join the team. For right now, until I build up loot, um, Homeboy right here. I forgot what his name is. I forgot what Pyro Boy name is. Um, Y'all can tell me in the comment, in the um, chat. I'm going to build him up because I really want to use him. Because he seems interesting. So, yeah, we're going to start this again. Damn. You know what? I may have... Actually, you should probably hypercarry with Clara. I know. Hold on. I don't understand what it means to hypercarry. I'm going to be honest with you. Even in Genshin Impact, I never understood what it meant to be like hyper carrying with any character. I just use my characters. Take out Serval and Ratio. Okay. Wait, so I'm only gonna roll with these two? Is this what hyper carrying is? Just rolling with two characters and that's it? Okay, so I only have Sparkle. Yeah, I only have Sparkle to put on the team. I don't have um, Ting Yun at all. Which really sucks, because I really was hoping I could get the character, but I don't have her. So I only got Sparkle. Luke is good, but nobody uses him because it's better four stars. Because there's better four stars. 
That's cool. So I need to bring another destruction character down. That's what this means. And the only other highest destruction character I have is Homegirl right here. Feels like this is a smart move, but she doesn't do like widespread damage with her attacks. Hmm. Oh boy. I gotta think. Hold on, hold on. Or maybe I just don't bring her and bring somebody else. No, another Harmony character. Okay, cool. I know Homegirl right here is a Harmony character who replenishes skill points, but she's gonna get clapped, so I can't bring her. Payla? Okay, we should be good to go now, right? Cool. This time I should be able to get it with ease. Better surrender while you have the chance. I do like my short queens. Mm, oh my goodness. Never get tired of seeing her. Auto play. Ready for another? Perfect. Clara doing her thing, Julian. Hold up, pause. Well, you have to use your techniques. Uh, before I enter the fight? Wait, who do I have on team? I got Payla, I got Sparkle, I got Clara, and Natasha. Only, like, two of those. Okay. The only one of those skills is, like, the only one that I think I use. Well, well. Actually, never mind. I rarely use anybody's techniques because some of them just do healing or some of them just do attacks. That's the one. That's probably that's the only reason I don't be using their you know stuff. Use Sparkle Tech, then Paler. Okay, I remember that next time. They targeting my girl. No way. They already clapped her. We're gonna have to exit out the fight. We start challenge. Okay. So I guess we're gonna do this first. And then use Payla. I think. Alright, let's see how this works. Defense reduction. Okay. It was an accident. She was hauling out. Sparkle was getting gang banged in that um last round. I'm not gonna hold you, bro. I'm sorry, she for the streets. She was getting knocked around left and right. You should've saw her. She was bouncing on the walls and everything. Crazy. They about to spam all their moves. My girl keep getting attacked. If you don't stop aiming at her, what? Oh boy, we ain't gonna make it. This team is cooked. I'm sorry to say. Oh, so I should not auto battle in pure fiction. But if you want, you can auto battle on your account. Is hold up, I gotta push the chat up so I can see the rest of your comments. There we go. 
But if you want to auto battle only account that auto battle sucks. Yeah. Okay. I appreciate the information. I'll keep that in mind. We're gonna back out of the fight, obviously. Analyze the targets before you make a plan of action. Okay, temp uh, temp the child will prevent points from being calculated. That's fine. I gotta change my team setup. Yeah, auto battle isn't bad sometimes. But ooh, hold up. I love this imagery of birds clapped on a chain. This gives me Genshin Impact vibes seeing these chained birds. She's not that great for auto battle. Okay, okay. so I'm gonna change this team split. Let me look into the enemy details. That's what I need to know. So, wave one consists of these motherfuckers for damage, damage, damage. Electro. So, I need to bring another Electro character with me. So, technically speaking, I will have to either get rid of Pela. Well, only have one, two, three. Only have three Electro characters. So, I will have to get rid of Pela and put Serval on here. And since I'm gonna be doing weakness breaking, I'm gonna have to replace, what is I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace Sparkle and put her on there. But I heard I need my Dr. Ratio, don't I? Or better yet, I don't need to bring Dr. Ratio if I have her. So that means I gotta replace nobody. Guess I'm just rolling with this. Never mind. forget what I'm saying. I'm gonna roll with this. No? Oh, then who should I roll with for the first wave? <laughs> Survival, what's up? I'm, gonna tell you, I'm telling you, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I just had an idea. Nah, my Survival been saving my ass sometimes. Shoot, I think she's one of my most built characters in the game. Now I'm thinking about it. Well, except for Dong Hung, of course. Unless I train... No, I'm not doing that. Never mind, we can continue. I got faith in this team. <laughs> now, how should I dispose of you? Oh, hold up. So, let me do this. That's fine. That's whatever. Perfect. Better clap this team now. No way. So we're discount Kafka. No, don't do my girl like that. <laughs> Finally. Let's go. We doing our thing right now. You can fight it. Or rock with it. Just a little something. That one's dead. Pause, let me take a read of this. People shoot on Kafka's follow-up attack, but it still has its advantages. True, I don't have the character, so I can't really, I can't really talk bad about her, honestly. But I do want the character. If she ever has a rerun, I might pull for her. Yes, don't talk about her like that. Nobody cares. <laughs> yeah. Let's 
I got faith in my girl, Serval, to do the job. That's why I don't give up on her. Perfect timing. Bro, we wasted so much movesets on the prior thing. Crap. Where is my herder? She should be flying in with fall up attacks. Come on. Crap. It's too late. We fucked up. Only 11? Well, at least that's higher than last time. Last time I only got out with like 10. This time is going to be easier. So, put shield up. Um, I don't know what Lynx does. She just restores, but I don't know what I need to restore right now. So I guess I'm just gonna slash. Auto play. You can see how this goes. I weep for the depart. It is a fall. Oh! I didn't know that. It uses free heals for two turns. I did not know that. My apologies. I thought there was just like stuff to use before you enter the fight. Well, granted, that is what it is, but I didn't know it had like extra stuff to it. My bad. Pause, let me read what Julian said. I didn't want Mommy Kafka, but some YouTubers made me some of her because they said without Kafka, Black Swan is trash. I would never believe anything I see on YouTube now. Black Swan turns Kafka into a god. Well, see, look at there. Look at there, Julian. Shoot, you got your clarification. Not just your certification, but the validation of those opinions on YouTube. Shit, this is one of the reasons why I wanted to play Honkai Star Wars earlier, because Black Swan was coming around the door and whatnot, so I wanted to grab her. But, of course, things didn't turn out that way, and I got on the latter half where Sparkle rolled up. <laughs> Man, my team is rock solid, bro. Oh. Perfect. I weep for the depart. It too shall fall. Oh yeah. It too shall fall. He's dead. He didn't die, excuse you. I feel like my pure fiction run going great right now. This is the last cycle. Come on, we gotta get them points up. Come on. I weep for the Stack them points up. It is a fall. Come on. You're not gonna make it in time. Come on, get the last hit in at least. I was so close. Okay, so team one is what's really holding me back. So I gotta work on team one, obviously. But let me double check team one again. Who in team one? It was one because I don't have an imaginary character that does multi, multiple imaginary damage, which is one of the reasons why I should, hold up, let me take a look at something real quick. 
Bro, I only have enough of one pull. Are you serious? I'm so tempted to swipe my card right now. I'm so tempted. I'm so I'm genuinely tweaking right now. How many can I get from this? Five. I'm wait. How many can I get from the exchange? I only get about one of these from the exchange. Oh, there's five people here that's watching. That includes me and four other people. So to the other two people who are watching, yo, what's up? I'm doing the pure fiction for the first time. I'm trying to clap it. You've been completing simulated universe twice every week? Well, that depends on what world I'm on. So let me go ahead and double check it right now. So if I go to here, then I travel here. Then let's go on in here. Let me take a look and see how, well, I think world five is the last, world three, four, five. Yeah, I unlocked world five, but I'm in the midst of running world three again. I don't remember why though. Okay, so I was clearly doing something in world three, but I can't remember what the hell I was doing. So I'm gonna go back and see what I was doing. Oh, that's right, I was in the midst of a domain. Which I should now be able to clap faster. Oh, I was right before like the final, no, this ain't the final boss. Dream that the gleam of old lakes. Wait, what path did I choose? Which path did I choose? The highest path is preservation from what I'm seeing. No, let me double check that again. Oh, preservation. Okay, so I'm on preservation. I'm gonna hit something random. All right, let's continue. I should be able to bang this out relatively fast. Preservation, don't have preservation, so we got Nihility instead. Shut up. Oh, how did I miss that? Man, that was a waste of a move. Nihility, Nihility. I'm gonna combat instead. I hope I can bang this up relatively fast. Shut up. You can get a lot of pulls for free because you still need to look for trash cans and chests and need to do the puzzles. Oh, that's right. I sure do, don't I? Yeah, I haven't fully ex finished exploring um, Pentaconi at all. Now I'm saying, thinking about it. So we're gonna choose this one. Oh, final boss, we made it. Level 64, okay, now I know why I didn't wanna do this. But we're gonna do it anyway. We got this. You also need to complete simulator twice every Single week for one free pull and a few more. Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna be doing um tomorrow, probably during the weekend as well. That's probably what I'm gonna do. Cause I ain't got nothing else to do. Why did I bring Dr. Ratio? I do not have the necessary elements equipped to fight this nigga. You need to be daily quest every day, so not a month, it's better than nothing. Not 
I do not have the perfect team for this. Why did I have this team set? This is horrendous work. No way. I'm about to quit out. Yeah, it gives you more, a bit more than half a goal. Okay, we're not doing this. End and finalize right now. I need to reset my team because I am not about to be disrespectful like this. No, absolutely not. Appreciate it. Well, how much did I get done? I'm not accepting that. We're gonna do this again. Cause World 2 that I was trying to clap. So World 2 consists of, I need imaginary electric. Okay, okay. So that's why I brought the, the ratio with me. Okay, this makes sense. But it seems I'm gonna have to need to remove someone. So Dr. Ratio is gonna have to go. And Payla, where's she at? She's coming along. Or better yet, I may just bring another Nihili unit. Mm. Oh shoot, I forgot. I got a Nihility Pyro character or a Destruction Pyro character I can use. I hate that mini boss. Yeah, hold on. Let me. I'm not even going to do it. Hold on. I'm not even going to do it real quick. Let me Let me do something real quick. Let me check. No, that's not what I meant. Where my boy Luca? Okay, that's what his name was. And you know what? I'm probably going to work on Luca real quick. I might details okay so this is the light cone I select okay so I just go to the light cone and select that I don't gotta do all that so his light cone Pela has the highest one no Pela and Alcron has the highest one so which light cone would work best for Luca at least for the four star light cones If I build too many mid characters, my account will suffer. Mm, I'm willing to take the gamble, honestly. I'm willing to take the gamble. GNSW. Good night, sleep well. Okay. So I can just swap. Okay, so how many more do I have of those? Okay, so I got one more that's over here. So I'm going to save that for later. I'm just setting him up right now so I can work on him later. Cause I really want to use this dude mainly because he's a nihility unit and because I can use him with Alcaron so because we have that double nihility stuff going on or triple depending on which and I gotta build these other characters because I want to use these niggas I hate the idea of having so many characters yet not using any also superimpose that okay cool I want to use homegirl right here because damn Okay, next stream, without a shot, without next stream, I'm going to do that whole ghost thing, that ghost story quest, or whatever it's called, because I came across it exploring the Lafu, so I know where it's at, and I know when it started. So, possibly during the weekend, if I get a chance, or Monday, I'm going to do the whole, you know, the, the what is it called, the ghost Lafu stuff. It's a funny quest. Yeah, also, I really like Ho, I, I really like um, Ho Ho. I really like her personality. She's very cute and adorable, and I love the fact that when, even when she fights in the game, she like she gets pushed forward towards the enemy, and she does like she like does like a mini slap across their face, and then she runs away. I think that's very cute. You should build Clara. She can solo solo to me in the universe. You know what? That's who I should have brought on the team. Shoot, screw all that. Never mind. I know exactly who I'm gonna bring on the team now. Appreciate you for telling me. But she level. F I can't use her right now, though. Because she's not leveled up. Hold on. Let me take a look at her real quick. Where my girl at? Where she at? Where she at? Where she at? Here she go. Okay, 
So, guess we're gonna farm some stuff right now. Probably your second best unit. Cool, okay, so I guess I gotta go farm the, you know, XP stuff before I level her up. So, I need to go back to Jarilo, because that's the easiest one I remember. And we're gonna farm this stuff up. We good to go. Start. I rely on Clara a lot. I swear these two clean up so fast. To betray my customers, I charge extra. That was fast. <laughs> I had to do a little bit more. Dr. Uh -huh. can do super damage well though, but nothing holds a candle to Alcaron. I'm gonna say this right now. I hope that any new character that's coming along can actually rival Alcaron in terms of her meta standing. Because her meta standing right now is just overly overpowered. I hope we get more characters that fit her along with her and her overpowered status. I'm gonna say this right now. If Sam is coming along in the next patch, I will waste my pulls on Sam if I do not get a venturing. I'm telling you that right now. I'll skip both a venturing and Jing Liu and get Sam. No sooner than 2.3? Shoot, I'll wait. Crap. Okay, so how much did I get from that? Let me take a look. Where my girl? Where she at? Where she at? Where she at? Oh yeah, here she go. Okay, so how much can I do now? Hmm. It's worth it. Now she level sixty. Yay! What about destruction light cone though? I have. Okay. What does this one do? Yeah, Harmony Trailblazer. I ain't gonna hold you. I will put Clara Glear, Carol's gears on Sam until I can farm Sam's gears. Yeah, I can't wait either. Because honestly speaking, the fact that from Jirilo, Lafu, Penacone, the fact that it took. What? We skipped a whole other planet. And then now we're getting a new power or a new path for the Trailblazer. In my opinion, I feel like we should have been getting multiple paths for the Trailblazer since, you know, Pinnac since um, Jarilo till now. The fact that we didn't get one for the Lafu was crazy, in my opinion. Because we shouldn't have even focused on Don Hung. We should have focused on the Trailblazer getting that, you know, that the hunt power. You feel me? And changing his weapon into like a bow or something. Honestly speaking. We got one per pen in it. But we didn't get one for the Lafu though. That's the thing. The Lafu the Trailblazer didn't get um um the Lafu power or no the hunts. That's what it is. Cause we have destruction and preservation, but we don't have the hunt, which is weird. And we're about to get harmony from how the leaks sound. Not how they sound, that's confirmed. What? Bellabog was destruction. 
Lafu got preservation. Bro, do you remember how the story quest went? Because I recently just played it. Like a month ago. We did not get no destruction power. For sure. Hold up. Bro, ain't no way you sitting here telling me for sure that we the Trailblazer unlocked preservation power in the Lafu. I'll wait till you make another response. Oh, that's good for her. Okay, yeah, hold on. What's up? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Julian. Uh, Julian understand what I'm saying. But, JL, I don't know what you remember, but we did not unlock preservation in Lafu. I just got done playing it. Shoot, the, the Trailblazer didn't even unlock the, the hunt power in, in that story. But preservation was Bellabog, without a shadow of a doubt. If you want proof, you can go back and look at the old my older live streams from like a month ago. <laughs> you know, put some more views on those videos. Appreciate it. You unlock it at the end. So, quick, quick clarification. There is not hunt yet. Oh, he's talking about Eidolons. Is that what you're talking about? You're referring to the Eidolons? You're referring to this, right? Okay, never mind then. Because I thought you was talking about the path. The new path for the Trailblazer. That's what I thought you was referring to. My bad. My apologies. Because I wasn't even talking about like his Eidolon set. I was just talking about his path set. Because the only reason I was saying that. Because for one, in Genshin Impact, we know that the Traveler keeps unlocking. Um, keeps unlocking his elemental power. Well, a new elemental power each region he goes to just by attaching the Statue of Seven, right? So it's like, in this game, it's like, it's going to be even hard. I guess they wanted it to be harder for the MC to obtain the power of the paths from these Aeons. I guess that's what they want to do. So that's probably why we don't have the hunt path yet. Despite the fact he should have had it. Granted, I guess it's story reasons for why. It's just the writing, I guess. Nice. Because you beat Bella Bob before you got preservation. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Anyway, what was I doing just now? Oh, that's right. I need to swap light cones. Give me that. Okay, perfect. Now I can do the pure fiction thing. So, how do I do pure fiction? What is this? Oh, this equilibrium. I'm not trying to do that. Where is the pure fiction? I'm not stupid. Where is this thing at? There it is. Found it. <gasps> oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. My computer's going to die. Hold up. I got to plug it in. Come on, come on, come on. Perfect. Save myself. E6 preservation. Wait a minute. So I didn't, I did not, so for me, I didn't unlock like his six Eidolon for his character. How do I obtain, how do I obtain that? Because I didn't even know, I didn't even realize that. That I only have two Eidolons for his character. I didn't even know that. How do I unlock the rest of that? I get it for free? Let me take a look at his character again. 
because Yeah, I don't have the power stuff to unlock it. A shop. Okay, so it's a shop in. I need to open up chests and do quests in Lafu in order to unlock more of his trailblaze power. You can buy it in the shop as well. So let me double check. Let me go check out the thing real quick. Give me a second. Where is the shop? There it is, store. So let me take a look at this real quick. Hmm. Okay, so it's not here. So that means it's in a different store. Oh, Lafu shop. Okay, cool. So let me go ahead and go over there real quick. Lafu, we were already here. So I guess I just double check Lafu shops. That's the grocery store, vending machine, vending machine, vending machine, food stall, whatever. Not, oh, was it this one? Nah, this time about unclean packages and all that type of BS. I'm not trying to go over there. Oh, it should be here. Okay, I'm just travel to which one. And then I'll just run around and see. Wherever there is business, there is Sampo. I don't believe you. Please do not tell me this is a carrot I was supposed to talk to do a quest from. I can buy stuff from you. It's not you. Never mind. No, because I remember. Hold up. Let me pull my map up, hopefully. It should be around here. So, it should be one of these. So let me just travel over here. Yeah, you got most of the money from reward. Okay. Cause I remember there being a store over here. Yeah, this one. I just I recommend you pick. I could be wrong. This is probably not it. Nope, this wasn't it. It's one of these stores for crying out loud. What about you? No. Do it. We have some amazing. Yeah, here it is. Found it. But the problem is, I can't get it because I don't have enough. Which I don't understand. How? How do I obtain this? Oh, okay. I found it, so now I know what I gotta do and whatnot. So, um, but that's not the point of what I'm supposed to be doing right now. I'm supposed to be saving that for later. Right now, I'm supposed to be more chance to get it. Is that only unlocked 11? Four out of 11. So, where the hell are the rest of these chests at? All right, I guess I'm gonna be running around for these chests then. I get, oh, there go one. Too bad I don't have you elemental like sight. It. I would be able to see all these chests. Yours for the taking. There's nothing here. Oh. Nope. Nah. Do I have Topaz? No. Unless you was asking Julian that question, then he most likely has it. Nope. Oh my goodness, homegirl right here. But is this gonna initiate a quest? Oh, okay. So Topaz helps with finding, finding chests, okay. Okay, so she's also. Oh, I'm gonna say this too. Another good thing that I like about this game: there is a playable character out in the open world, and they are here just doing whatever. Right? In Genshin Impact, we do not have this. In Genshin Impact, once the story quest ends, the characters cease to exist in the world. 
of Genshin Impact in the open world. They cease to exist, and it's so freaking weird to me. It's like, just let the playable characters be all around the map so it can feel more lively. For crying out loud. Okay, not this way. Oh, there go one right here. Almost done. So I gotta keep looking for more. And there's not gonna be none over there. I looked over there. Looked over there. So now I should go to the right and look over here. Oh, here got another one. Hopefully I find all of them within record time. Nope, not over here. I'm gonna go this way. I use Topaz for new map content religiously. She was worth it. I'm even more jealous. The only sad thing about Topaz is her booty cheeks becoming flat. Hmm, interesting song, I guess. I thought she was a dragon for a second. Okay, I should be. There we go, another box. Now, let's check and see if I explore it all. Yeah, her cheeks was gone. I was not playing with. I was not playing with big ass. Was uh, bro, po Topaz. They should have just kept her booty cheeks. I don't know why they censored it. The only logical reason for censoring it is because of quote unquote oh global players complaining about mm, female characters being curvaceous. Blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, shut the f up. Niggas can't even enjoy games no more. Wait. Sexy female characters at this point. It is sad. It's genuine. It's genuinely sad Don't even get me started on the stellar blade stuff Cuz these people acting goofy in relation to that too Okay, so let me keep exploring Okay, so it's not this way. Which way was it? Okay, this way My pal said he could pull a few strings I mean, yeah, she's still a bad bitch. That's obvious. No one will ever deny that. But it's sad that her cheeks had to be flattened. Shoot, if anything, I would rather have her chest be flattened over her booty cheeks. I'm a booty man. Me personally. I ain't a breast boy. I love the cheeks. Because honestly, what? Be, let's be honest. What you gonna hit all night long? You're not hitting the chest all night long. You're hitting booty cheeks all night long. So the fact that the booty cheeks had to get, you know, shrunk it down is sad. You weep a tear for it. Which way, which way, which way, which way should I go? Which way should I go? I guess I'm going to go over here. Oh, there go another box. I guess I done found them all now at this point. Okay, I got one more. And it's not this way. And apparently not this way either. It's an unavailable area. Excuse you. So this sounds like they're going to either extend the map in the future or they're not going to touch it. You can motorboat. <laughs> motorboat what, my go my guy? A board? <laughs> A flat board? Uh, hold on, let me let me give let me put more to perspective of what I'm saying. Not nah, your bad example. What you going to do? You going to motorboard this? It's flat. It's a board, my guy. There ain't no motorboarding going on anywhere. Shoot, if anything, you're gonna be hitting the pavement. <laughs> Nothing but rib cage. <laughs> and it's gonna hurt. Not hurt us. <laughs> what you mean? It's the best example. Unless I'm understand I'm misunderstanding what motorboarding is. Oh, hold on. what's this? Excuse you? Yeah, no, I'm just checking all over here because I'm missing one more chest to get up. Yeah, do this? What you mean? You talking about this encounter that's going on right now on my screen? Do this?
or are you agreeing to the advice? Oh, okay, yes. Okay. What are you doing? She look good too, honestly. Okay, check it out. Oof. You think so? You should have told me that. <laughs> I already, yeah, I agree with you, Julian. I already told you last time in a different stream. I can't remember which one it was. I told you I'm going to break that doll, honestly. Me, personally, I'm destroying her doll. Baby, I'm destroying all of them. And then she's going to keep sending out more. Keep watching. Good grief. How did I miss again? Must you toss in a coin before you go anywhere? That's so superstitious. Don't lose faith. Give it a few more tries. Okay. I'm gonna keep watching. Unless I'm not supposed to. No, don't keep watching. So I should stop her, right? Oh, it's an exit symbol. I just noticed it. My bad. Okay, we done got dragged off somewhere. Oh, my dude, I'm supposed to. I stopped there. Then the real hitter gonna show up and say, You did it with all my dolls. How about you do it do it to me? And you're gonna be like, Nope, old lady. Pfft, incorrect. That's what you gonna do, Julian. I'm going all in. I don't care. <laughs> she can be a thousand years old, three thousand years old. I don't give a crap. <laughs> I'm going full in. I'm gonna beat the dust off that. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say that joke. Nope, I'm not even gonna say that. <laughs> you get the image, you get the picture. Now, what the heck I'm supposed to be doing right now? She'll say, Kuru, Kuru, right before she slaps you upside the head. I'll take the hit full force, because then I'll have every legal right to swing my fist into her face. But that depends if she got some crazy ability that's gonna kill me before I even get a chance to raise my fist. Hold up, where am I supposed to be going at? Okay, so I was over here. I was I was one chest away from getting everything, but I missed it somehow. No, I didn't miss it. I went the wrong way. So that means I gotta go back over here and do it again. Okay, Wherever so I was going the right business, way. So I mean, I gotta go back down this way, and then this time I take a left. So I didn't go this way. More than likely, there's a. Ch yep, there you go, found it. Boom, got them all. Yes. No cash. Okay, so now I should go over back to the shop and see if I can buy it. We have some amazing. I don't care. Give me what I want. It's 260. Perfect. It's, it is usually easier to leave the last chest behind, but you found it. Oh. So you tell me the way you play in relation to like finding chests, you'll find one chest that you remember the location of, and then you just go get all the other chests. Chest, and then you come back to the last one, the first one you found, right? That what you do? Find the first one, leave it behind, get the rest, come back to the first one. Claim, thank you. 
claim again. Ooh, I got me a new one. Perfect. I got claim again. Oh no, it's just a heart. Find the last chest. Okay. Now I can increase his defense power, possibly, if I remember correctly. Okay, so what does this third one do? Oh, it levels up my skill and talent. Perfect. The value of choice lies in unwavering resolve. Because you discovered the map. Okay. Okay, so now let's take a look at these traces. Oh, that's awesome. Shit, now his defense gonna be crazy. Okay, so now I've done explored all this. What was I doing before this? I was doing something, I can't remember. Oh, n I remember now. I was supposed to be in the pure fiction thing. Hold up, what about this? Where's this at? I need to go harvest a little bit of this first, then I'm gonna hop into the um, pure fiction. You can find last chest if you want to, cuz. Hold up. There we go. You can find the last chest if you want to, cause it does give you a little bit more stuff to pull. Perfect. Okay, so I need to do this before I move on and do anything else. Guess we're using some trailblaze power. Confirm. I swear I love that. I got so much Trailblaze power to use, and I can keep using it for at least for the rest of the stream to the 12 o'clock hour. Shoot, I'm probably gonna stop at 12.30. Okay, who do I need to bring? Oh, I got the whole squad right here, start. Auto play. To betray my customers, I charge extra. No way. There we go. Okay. Thank you. To betray my customers, he slides in. I charge extra. Flashes them up. That's what? better. Boom. Perfect. Oh, let me tell y'all something that happened. Hold up, hold up. Let me tell y'all something that happened. It was probably two weeks ago, three weeks ago. Can't remember. So, there's like, because y'all know in the Lafu, you know you do them whole, like, there's this whole, you know, device that flips around that allows you to jump from one platform to the other. You know what I'm talking about? That travel through. So, I was stuck trying to unpuzzle one of the, the maps that has all that BS in it. It wasn't until I figured it out that I have been walking onto the wrong pathway and didn't walk all the way through the pathway, all the way through, is one of these maps. I didn't walk through it all the way through. That's because I didn't, and all that crap. And I figured that out probably two weeks ago. And I was like, how was I supposed to know this was on here when the map goes all white once the pathway ends at a certain point? The map turns all white. How was I supposed to know that? And so I figured out all that BS out and I finally, you know, f fulfilled the map or finished the map. <laughs> It was so irritating. I was running around for like about an hour. Probably two hours if I think about it. Julian, you better tell me what you're saying. 
If I knew how to speak Japanese, boy. To betray my customers. I am not gonna hold you though. Japanese is a language I thought I would love. Talking smack about you. <laughs> I can't even tell, that's the worst part. <laughs> Granted, the Japanese is like one of the languages I thought I would love, I would want to learn, but that's only because I kept watching anime a lot. That's the only reason I thought I was like, because it's certain words in Japanese that you pick up on and be like, oh, so that means this word, X, Y, Z, right? Or this phrase, whatever, right? But then I found out their whole alphabet system is wild. So I'm like, whoa, hold up. What is their alphabet? Do they have one? I looked at it, I was like, there's no way I'll be able to learn this. There's no way. I said it is what it is and something else. <laughs> you better tell me what that something else is, Julian. I charge extra. We don't hide secrets around here. This community is built on trust. We're just having fun. Oh, the autoplay off. <laughs> Bro, what was that? The Japanese have at two alphabets? That's wild. And Julian, what do you mean you can't tell me? What, was it something wild? Kanji and I forgot that one, but Kanji is super hard. Yeah, what I, okay. So what I remember about learning about the Japanese alphabet or the language, so to speak, the language from what I understand, the lingual of the language just kept changing or as time passed, similar to how like in America, right? The way we used to talk about like 200 years ago is not the way we talk now, right? The, the lingual kept changing, right? And the way of like certain like slang and whatnot, right? But I think for when it come down to the Japanese language, it, it, it was like a cultural shift for each different era of language. I'm not sure that is Japanese. Shoot, I can't tell either. It could be Korean, it could be Chinese for all I know. No, I think the first two lines he sent the first time, I think that's Japanese. The latter two lines, I think could be Korean or it could be Chinese. I could be absolutely wrong. Julian, the only one that knows. He told me he learned how to speak Japanese from his friend. To betray my customers, I charge extra. How much did I get from that? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to run it one more time and then I'm gonna be able to level up my uh, my Clara's skills and whatnot. Then I'm gonna hop into pure fiction. And I'm gonna bang out floors one and two before tonight, before I end the stream. I promise you that. See Julian over here playing all these games. <laughs> Tell myself, maybe it is Japanese, maybe it's not. <laughs> Bro, if you all get out of here with this BS. Also, I'll be right back. I gotta check and see if there's any family members that have returned home. I'll be right back. I gotta go check. Give me a moment. Back 
Kata Katakana. I don't remember them calling it that, but it is probably the easiest one. Oh, is that the um other alphabet of the Japanese language? The katakana? Shoot, I feel like I said that right the first time. Oh, hold up. Have any of y'all heard about the whole thing with those what IRL vloggers and the BS they've been doing in Japan or in Asian countries recently? Y'all seen stuff related to that? Cause I'm gonna be honest with you, it's one of the most vile stuff I've ever watched, honestly. Generally. Because seeing them them niggas act like goofballs toward the Japanese just for the sake of click it, clicks and clout and all that stuff is so cringe. And what's even worse is that these niggas don't learn their lesson. They ref it's either they're deliberately not learning for the first time from the first instance. And they're or they they know what they're doing and they keep pushing it because they want to be internet famous. It's the only for honestly, it's the um it's the latter. It's clearly the latter. They're doing it on purpose. And it sickens me, honestly. If these dudes end up missing and you know they got you know assassinated Vietnam style or something bad happens to them, bro, I don't care. The dude who's incarcerated, bro, that dude got bailed out. He got bailed out of that situation. From what I'm from from the recent information I know, he got bailed out of that situation. No, hold up. No, you talking about somebody else. You talking about somebody who was in um no no hold up. Let me correct myself. I think there was a different vlogger. He was in um Israel when he did his thing. And he got incarcerated. I think. I could be wrong. It's one and two. This thing about it's like I think it's about like three niggas, three different niggas who was doing some stupid goofy stuff. Like first of all, to do that in Israel is wild. You know dang well these people take their religion hella serious and the land that the religion is on. To even do something crazy like that, you best be prepare yourself to get locked up. Talking about the guy in Japan? Oh, never mind. Then the guy in Japan? Yeah, that mother effort. Yeah, he got bailed out. Uh, I think some a dude he know bailed him out of that situation. Which, honestly, shouldn't have been the case. He should have got locked up. Because you don't get to go to someone else's country and act like a goofball. Think, think nothing of it. <laughs> this cool, Julian. You ain't got to announce that you're going to stop now. That's better. Yeah, if he did that in the US, he would have got his ass beat. Yeah, he would. Honestly. Bro. Not even just that. We already seen instances like that. It was like last year. And yeah, it was somewhere around last year. I heard about a um a YouTuber. He was sitting trying to pull a prank on somebody in the grocery store. Homeboy got put got two what bullets put in his body. Crazy part is the dude survived the bullet shots. He survived both bullet shots and his dad sat here and defended his son's actions of being a goofball towards that person and the person in question who pulled the Glock out and let it sing for at least two, two seconds, he was the one who got punished in that situation. Honestly. And I was like, excuse you? Your son escaped death from his foolish actions and you defend his BS because of the sake of, oh, my son wouldn't do that. Or my son, I encourage my son's behavior and I support his YouTube content. Shut the F up. Genuinely. What type of BS? Yeah, he gonna continue harassing people. It's a good thing. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think Gideon is like, okay, Gideon, I think he's like one of the people who like, you know, help push that type of stuff forward. But... In his recent content, he stopped doing that and whatnot because, you know, he found God or whatever. Good for him. Amen. Hallelujah. Christian life. From one Christian to another. Yeah. Good stuff. I'm glad he stopped doing that because, shoot, I even came across some of his old stuff of what he would do and he would get kicked out of, like, basketball games and whatnot because he was being disrespectful from sleeping in the front row of the court and whatnot. All the other BS he was doing. So, I'm glad he stopped. Hopefully, he permanently stops. He stopped. 
But like, yeah. Everyone else copied his behavior and they then they started taking it too far. To betray my customers, I charge extra. Oh, also, I'm gonna say this. If y'all have any topics I want to talk about right now, so like you know, so stuff can you know get flying, so it doesn't feel like a boring stream and nothing going on except for me having it on autoplay mode. Y'all can go ahead and tell me some stuff that probably happened in y'all day or whatever y'all want to talk about. I'll be down to talk because I run my mouth a lot, as you see from this live stream. It could be about anime, video games, whatever. And it could be whatever, um, whatever Julian talking about right now. That as well. I'm gonna pretend I understand everything he's saying and make up bullshit conversations. That's better. He just said ass. Hmm. You know what? I can see it. The ASS, I can see it. Because I see the ass you spell in English and his that he spelled in Japanese. It looked like it fits perfectly. I was watching the guy with red hair bullying Asta. I didn't say ass. Okay, so you said something else then. Red hair guy bullying Asta. Red hair guy bullying Asta. Is this from a different anime? Or is it from Hanukkah? I'm gonna figure that out on my own. Y'all continue y'all conversation. Oh, Black Clover. Red hair guy bullying Asta. The only instant, no, that wasn't episode one. Never mind, forget that. Red hair guy bullying Asta. Was it the young fire boy, a part of the fire, the flame heart family? Or was it a different character? Cause there's only like three characters who have, he's part of the black bulls that use his trap magic. Oh, I know who you talking about now. Homeboy who's bandaged up from head to toe. His face is all covered up and whatnot. I know who you talking about now. He came in last second in like the latter half of the of the first season, I think. Or, yeah. I forgot what his name was though, but he was a dope character. To betray my customers, I charge extra. Natasha, my Natasha doing her thing right now, I swear. Natasha done saved me throughout this whole game ever since I first got her. Yeah, if I remember, because I think he showed up before the, the, um, the exam, the exam for like the elite magic team they was going to put together to defend against the um, I, Eyes of the Midnight Sun. It was right before. It was right around that time he came in. 
right before they got their squad set up before the Midnight Sun um, invasion or attack went off. Okay, now my girl should be ready to go to be leveled up. So let me take a look at it real quick. My Clara, where are you doing? Traces, let's take a look. Five, okay, so I gotta transmute them. Synthesize time. So where is it? Boom, here we go. At best I can get nine pieces out of it. Are you serious? Whatever. Oh yeah, I remember that because I think I, I have watched. I think it may have been a filler episode, or it was labeled as a filler episode. Oh, I can just do that from her traces. Oh, my bad. It just, it's just like it's got so many avenues just to go to like what you're trying to get to in this game, and it's like my brain has already locked in on one pathway to get to it. Ooh. What's this? What's this item for? Oh, rare item used to custom make relics. It can model itself according to expectations. Okay. That's interesting. Let me take a look at this. God, those. Oh my goodness, my stomach grumbling. Did I eat when I got home today? No, I didn't eat a damn thing. Those are decent. Okay. Okay, okay. Hold up. What was I doing? Okay. Gotta think, 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 think. What was I doing? Oh, Clara. I need to level up Clara stuff because I'm going back into Pure Fiction before I end this stream and I'm getting my get back. 5, 10, 15. Perfect. So that's gonna be 5, 10, 15. Boom. Okay. Now I'm ready to get my get back. Hold up, let me double check with something. One more time. I gotta double check the light gone. Okay, I'm ready to spin the block on the Pure Fiction now. So let's get to it. I gotta find it first. Uh, where was Pure Fiction at? Oh, it was on the lava. Uh, oh, excuse me. Time to spin the block. There it is. I'm gonna pass it this time. I got it in the bag now. Wherever there is business, there is oh. Okay, she's been leveled up. She got her thing going on. Okay, so now can you buy her from store? I'm not. I'm not even sure I can get her from the store. Let me double check. Hey, what am I doing? Okay, store. Oh, okay, so let's double check the store. No, but these two goofballs here. Oh, from Herda store. Oh, okay. Wait, how do I even access Herda store? Oh, it's in the simulated universe. Never mind. So I now gotta travel back to the space station. To the simulated universe. I'm not even sure. I don't even remember there being a store. How do I? Where's the st Oh, there it is right there. Nah. Also, I've been saving my ticket stuff up because I was going to use it for other stuff. I got 10 tickets at best right now. I'm going to save these tickets though. I'm not going to use them right now. That's all she got too. That's the worst part. I'm gonna leave that alone too. By fall of Eon right now. I mean Aeon, I'm stupid. Is this good to use? Oh, level up for Clara, okay. Okay, I'm gonna leave that alone. I'm gonna work on that later because I don't have the material to work on that right now. I'm gonna have to dive into the um, 
that domain crap for Clara's stuff. Anyway, where was I going? Pure fiction. Ooh, okay. Appreciate the information, y'all. So where was I going? It's pure um uh, oh my brain all over the place. I'm trying to think. Okay. This time I should be able to pass through way the first floor of this place. Wherever there is business, there is sampo. I should be able to pass it now. So let's double check the team. Healer coming in from there. There. Okay. Hmm. I may have to replace Serval with someone else. I'm gonna have to replace her with Dr. Ratio. Or, no, nah, Dr. Ratio is the only other imaginary character I have. I didn't buy it though, cause I got her light on. Oh, hold up. Uh, Serval gotta go. So where's she at? Buy the shoe here. Boom, all right. We got it this time. I, I got it in the bag this time. Without a shot, without. Okay, can you take it? This does damage when I'm doing that. That does damage too. Target. This does a taunt, so boom. Finally, I'm gonna attack with this. Need I teach someone a lesson? Links taste so good and sweet. I got her L light cone as well and used it, but supposedly five falls light cone better than one. Ooh, hold on. Julian, I'm taking Lynx and every other no short female character from you Patience and every short chick in this game. Because the majority of the chicks in this game is like f four feet tall. I'm taking all of them from you. Fushuan, and all of them. I'm taking them off your list. They belong to me now. I'm ready for the fight. What you trying to do? I'm taking them all from you, bro. You're not stopping me. Dibs don't mean nothing. Did y'all forget what type of game this is? This is a turn-based game. <laughs> it's back and forth. The only people winning with is the ones with a better team set. I'll say this right now. If I cannot collect... Oh, what's up, Silver Wolf? Finally, you arrived. Turn-based dibs is my dibs. I'm saying this right now. If I can't beat the score for this, um, what's it called? Um, pure fiction. If I cannot beat the score for the pure fiction, then you win. You can have Fu Shuang, but I will fight you for Sparkle and Links. Oh, are you too late? Yeah, unfortunately, you missed out. So I guess I'm going to, have to explain real quick. Okay, pause it. Okay, so now I get to explain what happened. Um, you remember last stream I did, I couldn't get past, um, Aventurine's, um, you know, build, his phase two. I couldn't get past it. So, what I did was, on Wednesday night, I was building up my characters and whatnot. And I was using Aventurine as a damage check to see how far I would get past him. Get past, um, him with, with the team I ran with. The team consists of Alcaron, Serval, Herda, and Natasha. And I ended up killing him all the way through, even though I didn't mean to. I was going to quit out once I got to like 9% of his health bar in phase 2. But um, Herda and Alcaron clapped him. And so the game entered into his next cutscene. And so I had to quit out the game. And for the past, out, for the past what, day or two? Until tonight, I had to wait to live stream so that I can show y'all. What happened? Unfortunately, I can't show y'all the fight because, you know, I beat him. But I won. It was a good fight. I clapped him all the way through. So let's continue. Yeah, there you go. That's what happened. I got, he was at one HP and then the, the um thing started. What time is it for me? It's about to be 12 o'clock in the morning. In the next couple of seconds.
Oh, so you are an hour behind me? Okay, so you live in a different time zone then. And for Julian, yes. I'm only saying it for this instance because, you know, online stuff. And we do not wish to have online problems. But we've seen it too many times. Online problems get people caught up and it's get dastardly. Mediocre. But it's not even for my benefit, but it's for your benefit when I say this. Zero points. Time to kill. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Just a little something. Thank you. By the time the component damage. Suppress. If y'all don't fight back against this chick, she kicking our tail right now. Okay, stop it at right now. No. Where's she at? It's two of them. We're gonna heal her first. Time for you to do your thing. Mm -mm. Do you have links? If so, she's a better healer in this team for Clara because she can give taunt with her skill for Clara. Oh. Well, yeah, I have her. I built. I leveled her up to level 60 and whatnot. So I guess I should back out right now. Okay. Okay. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna back out right, and then I'm gonna put links on the team. High threat target ahead. I'm gonna put the links on the team and. Then I can beat Julian in my bet that I placed on it. No, I pressed enter by mistake. Oh my goodness gracious, I'm so stupid. Back button again. Thank goodness this PS5 loads fast. Okay, now we can do this. Okay, so who was I supposed to? Okay, Natasha gotta go. And where are my links at? Where is my girl? Oh, that's, she's on the other team, but that's why, that's the problem. So, so Natasha, you go on the bottom team. Links, you coming with us? Boom! Now we can get started. Now I'm gonna beat Julian in his bed. Boom! He told me if I do the skill now, it's gonna heal over for two turns. That's cool to know. I'm gonna slap this down, and now I'm ready to defeat Pure Fiction. Nah, I don't know about that, Julian. I told you I was gonna take your chicks from you. <laughs> I meant it. So, to prove how good my account is, at least for right now, I'm gonna see if I can beat this whole, beat at least this two floors. Use out the ratio skill before Clara. Yeah, did that? Yeah, I think that just happened just now. So, I ain't gotta worry about that too much. So, basic attack. Basic attack. No problem, I got it. I'm paying attention. Also, Julia, I see what you're talking about. I will fold you to the floor first before you even think you can put your hands on me first. I'm taking her. Use link skill on Clara. Crap, we getting clapped right now. Perfect. Should I heal? Should I heal the whole team? Even if it is a waste. Okay, cool. Should I heal the whole team now with Lynx's ult or should I wait? Don't heal? Cool. Hi. 
use the ult now. Perfect. I'm gonna use her to go ult too while I'm at it. You wasted her ult? Oh, my bad. Hmm, okay, so I guess I'm gonna use a basic attack now. Only use it. Only use if there are too many deep. Hold up. My bad, I gotta push the chat up so I can see it all. So, okay. Only use if there are too many CC debuffs or there's too many HP loss. Use it as soon as it comes up next time. Which O am I using when it comes up next time? Herda's? I mean, yeah, Herda's? Or am I using Homegirl Clara? Clara's. Okay, cool. So I guess I'm going to do a basic attack next. Yeah. Okay, about time we heal, because they are kicking my... No, we're doing it now. The best course of action would be to kill... Hmm... Shit. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Boom. Oh. SAS I'm gonna do it for this one. The measure of truth and falsehood. There are some tactics on Clara's Oh, but you should practice Clara's Oh as soon as it comes up. No. Okay, go. Uh imagine not maining Clara. I don't main Telepath DPS. Topaz for the win. Don't take my sardines, please. I use like dollars for sardines for links. I swear, y'all on something else right now. Oh, shoot. What I'm supposed to be doing right now? Okay, so I'm gonna assume I'm supposed to use link skill again now. Because usually I go with the flow, what I feel like doing. So I'm gonna let y'all guide me for at least this time. Use her skill now? Okay. Who am I using it on? Clara? Right? Okay. She's getting cooked right now. Oh my goodness. You know what? I'm about to press Herda's ult too because these niggas are clapping my shit. And I gotta find at least some way to. Oh, never mind. It's still not always Phil. Guess I'm using her. Oh, that was so worth it. Ten thousand points again. We stop back at this point. And now my clerk, my girl is useful. So, wait, who's providing this buff? Is this mother effort, isn't it? 
now I gotta crap. Not gonna play. Crap, he gonna get away. Probably not gonna hit everybody. Oh yeah, there we go. The Sinji going crazy right now. Hmm, I guess I'll tag homeboy right here. I don't care about the bird. Mediocre. No, we ran out of cycles. BS, and I stopped only at ten. Ah, I'm upset. Storms on the horizon. This is one reason why I won't jingle you. Jingle you would have provide the damage to kill these mother effers. Okay, hold up. Before this battle starts, um, I know I gotta do Look this first. This doesn't do nothing but do damage. This only provides the explosion thing, and the slash. This slash is gonna break this defense. You have links if you want to. Who? She's just using me for sardine. <laughs> I thought you was talking about meta related stuff only to realize halfway through reading your comment you were talking about I can have <laughs> I can have links but I can't have sparkle. Screen four. Screen four, I heard Sunday's boss is about breaking it seven and nine times I think. More than medicine. <laughs> Lands at the ready. Get. I weep for the departed. I can't have. I'm going to be on the floor. Stop it, Julian. I'm gonna put you on your ass. <laughs> Nigga, don't play with me. I'm taking what I want. Now, I will say this. I was annoyed at the fat robots when I first started playing back in Bellabog. I was annoyed by them, but since my defense is so freaking good now with my preservation trailblazer, I don't even care about the robots no more. Perfect, we're stacking stuff up. Okay, hold up. Jul I'm gonna excuse Super real quick. Julian, don't get me started. I have to walk up the staircase, back and forth. You know how tiring it is to run back up and forth the staircase so you can get back to the live stream so it doesn't feel like you just got the live stream on and people just in the comment section wondering where the f the mother f are at. That's the only reason I ran. That's the only reason I was out of breath. And plus, this dog be fighting me to walk outside. Every day is a fight. Free will, or was it? If you get eventually, you will stop playing Preservation Trailblazer. Nah, honestly, I won't. The only difference is either I'm gonna have both of them on the same team or. I'm going to put Trailblazer on a different team, just in case um, eventually not available. <laughs> That's just me personally. Wow, I got six people watching. That's awesome. I never had six before. Still waters Trying to see if I can beat. Oh, that's right. The mother efforts got me locked in a taunt. Shit. No. I forgot. He's clapped. Oh my God. Perfect. Lance of Blaze. Never the same team. I know they don't synergize together. I already know this. I'm not. I know this because because the whole oh he his shield attack. Da -da. I'm just I'm a very cautious dude, and I love just having double shields if it means I can survive. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Ugh! <laughs> 
Okay. It sucks so bad, it doesn't matter. What 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 sucks about it? Cause the only th I've been getting nothing but good results out of it. That's just me personally though. I don't really know what sucks about it. Dusty for oblivion. <laughs> That'll take more than medicine. <laughs> it is tiny. Look at it. It's small like your <laughs> Silver Wolf. Don't start. <laughs> Nope, we not doing this type of disrespect. Absolutely not. We not doing this tonight. Not on this Friday night. Shoot, I mean Saturday morning. That's what I meant to say. No one's gonna pay you to stand still. Another journey begins. On the still waters of oblivion. I weep for the departed. It is not fall. Crap, we're not doing enough damage fast enough. Forget your wallet? That's half the work. Just for oblivion. That'll take more than many. I weep for the departed. If you get adventuring, you won't want to ever bother with trailblaze preservation <laughs> bro i keep telling you it, to me it don't matter it don't granted you could be right because i'm not gonna lie ever since i've been using um uh, um what's her name alcoron left to say farewell ever since i've been using um alcoron i haven't used a lot of my other electro characters well my one other electro character which is serval i will admit that but that's only because i like using her all Lance ablaze. Lance! Forward! You should at least try to get a five star sustain at least so you can clear harder content. I know, but trying to get this boy so um eventually I wasted already wasted 50 pulls and I ain't get them. I gotta wait for the, like the next 50. Hopefully the next 10, hopefully. My team does more damage than your Alcaron. That's only because you you played the game longer. That's the only reason. What? We already ran out of... No! I failed. I was so close. Okay, so team one needs a revamp of some kind. I need a different... No, I need me a different imaginary character. That's the reason why. I need an imaginary character who does imaginary damage to multiple different enemies. And unfortunately, I entered into the game way too late and missed um, Imbibitor, and I missed out on, I quote unquote missed out on well, not really, because I can get him from the banner. Need to work on, focus on Alcaron. Yeah, I got, um, what's her name? Yukong, yeah, I got Yukong, but the thing is she only does like single target imaginary damage. Did I finish the baseball event thing? Uh, no. I was doing type. Oh my goodness gracious. Y'all should have been here Wednesday night. Well, no, because I wasn't live streaming Wednesday night. Wednesday night, I was trying to do this tide of war. Bro, tell me why. Phase three? Phase three refuses to give me an S. Phase three? Bro, it takes forever to get to Kafka because all these other enemies BSing in the way. Hold on, let me let me show y'all what I'm talking about, bro. Cause this thing really pissed me off. And then I have brought her. Who else did I bring? I'm not gonna bring Spark because I don't think I no. If I bring Spark, I'm not gonna have a healer. She'll mess up my account right now. My team to move. Okay. Hold on. What else was it? I'm gonna just bring her. I know. I need. I know. I have to get like 
like at least a B to get it all. But it just it's just the principle of like, bro, I can't even beat the third wave boss. And y'all about to see what I'm talking about. Y'all about to see. Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all. Start challenge. I'm gonna put on straight autoplay so y'all can see what I'm talking about. We're in trouble now. <laughs> I really did miss out on some cool ass characters. It did the same thing to me when I got to her and she only had like 9% health left. I know. Bro, by the time I reach her, I can't even do enough damage to kill her health bar. That's the worst part. Honestly, skill issue. It's not a skill issue when the game provided me the characters who's are, who are built a certain type of way. That's not a skill issue. That's the company issue. Granted, for some reason, we're still in phase five of turns. We're still in phase five. We haven't reached phase four yet. We're like two turns away from phase five, four. W, the trial characters are not even mid. Team building issues is, is team building issues, so skill issue. Okay. Just get better characters, because sometimes Cause some trial characters got mid build. World cleansing track. <laughs> Man, if y'all don't kill this mother effer already, kill him. End it. <laughs> Bro. We're already in phase four. And it's gonna end soon if these mother effers don't hurt and kill this fool. Track. He's still not doing enough, which is weird. <laughs> Sometimes. Okay. Okay, so they're subpar. So the trial characters are sometimes subpar. So that's the reason why I'm not getting a lot out of them right now to complete this task. That's the reason. Okay. But it seems like we're blowing through them pretty good right now. Hold on, what phase of turns are we in? We still in phase four of turns. We ain't reached phase three yet. This mother effer about to die. So let's see if they can be push faster. Thank goodness for his skill and ult. Hold up. Zero. Okay. Bro, that bird should have killed the mother effer. Anyway, would you rather scratch a plate with a fork or talk back to your mom? Scratch plate with a fork. I'm not gonna hold you. Sometimes, probably about. I think probably. I'm gonna. I'm gonna I'm share a little something honestly with me. Okay, so about. I think it was 2022, or it was begin. No, it was within the year of 2023. I was having job problems, trying to find a job and whatnot, and I got tight with my mom's. In relation to it, I'm not gonna hold you. I was ready to explode, but of course, like I ain't I ain't talked to her for like about a week, and then I found out she had a um she had a stroke within that time, and I didn't know about it. My younger brother knew about it before I did. I was like, huh? Why didn't nobody say nothing to me? She was like, because and he was like, oh, she um. She didn't want to um, tell us about it because, you know, we was trying to, you know, pay rent and whatnot. So, yeah. And we need money because rent expensive. This one, I was working at Amazon. And, bro, if any of y'all worked at Amazon before, y'all know how stuff get in that building. Can't go use the bathroom for a certain amount of time. You got to be back on that, on that floor getting to it. And you can fall asleep while working. I did that. I fell asleep while working, putting items in a bin. 
and I slept walked. I slept walked around a wall. I woke up, I was like, how did I get over here? But that's enough of that, about that does. So yeah, if I choose between scratching a fork with um, a plate and talk about it to my mom, I'm, I'm scratching the fork. Honestly. And the fork scratching the plate don't even sound that bad. Then in phase three, hopefully we can do a lot of news in this phase. Nope, apparently not. So we got two more phases left. Y'all better clap her already. Don't you let... No, I'm doing that now. I should do it first. No, she got my boy unpitticized. What are you using that? What oh, about to say? We got one phase left. Kill her, damn it. These are devils. I'll crush them all. No. She gonna get away. Bro. I will protect all beauty. Track. You better do your thing, I'm Barbiter. This man does so much break damage. Oh my goodness, he spammed it? Okay. Please spam y'all ults. Just do that. Please let me clutch this victory. Jesus. Back to back spamming? Oh my goodness, I'm being saved right now. Yeah, so let's go. He's spamming the crap out of this ult right now. No, we ran. No! It's still an A. Bro, I'm upset. We were so close. Homeboy was spamming his ult so many times. Adrilla's my mom. Not you. She's worshipped by many men. Adrilla. Wait, what character was Adrilla in this game? Anyway, I only got like two more of these to do anyway, so I guess I'll bane this out while I got the time. But first before I do that, I need to go check and see what my dog doing because he's growling at something. I'll be right back. <clears throat> Y'all can chat it up. Whatever y'all talking about, I'll be right back. Okay, so if y'all can hear my dog in the background, he complaining. He got to go outside. So I'm going to be right back. I'm probably just going to... What? I'm probably going to throw some random team together. Hold up. Let me let me throw a random team together, and then I'm going to go walk his other so he can get off my back. Whoa, follow-up attacks. Hold up. Who's on this team? Oop. Oh, I guess I'm bringing the whole quantum team. Hold up. Let me go find a quantum. I'm bringing her for my final quantum piece. I don't care. <laughs> Start. Hold up. Let me go ahead and get the set. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, I'm going probably. I'm going to put it on autoplay, but I'm going to put it. No, I'm going to put it on fast. Okay, I'm going to go walk my dog. I'll be right back. One. 
you find the answer? Human creations! No matter. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Execute the Marstruck! No one misses the Marstruck! Who's next? Disappear among the sea of butterflies! Illusions of the past!
Okay, I'm back. It's also good to know I got a <laughs> chat full of degenerates. I respect it. We are degenerates around here. No shame. Ears from the floor, tail plug wagging. That's wild. The fact that you even know anything about that is wild. <laughs> also, the only dog walking that's going on in here is me walking y'all. Except for JL, because JL gotta walk me through building characters. And he told me I gotta stop working on Shai or Shai? I'm still pronouncing her name wrong. I thought the old quantum team was gonna work, but I guess not. And now that I didn't even read the description of what I was supposed to do. Okay. When attacking, defeating a single target deals. No to the boss. Oh! No wonder they couldn't clap it. I see the problem now. I chose the wrong stuff. Increase. Oh, thanks. I was talking about some increased fall up attacks. Like, nigga, what? Okay, let's go back to the trial characters again. So. You gotta go. I'm gonna add him. Um, who else? She can stay. Sparkle might have to go. Hmm. But yeah, never mind. Two electro. Okay, okay. So Sparkle gotta go. Put her. Sway is super hard to build. No, oh, that's sad to know because honestly, I really want to build. Like, does the whole weakness break with her ultimate? I really like that because you know, it sounds good at least for me to use. And because she's a four star, I want to build my four star characters up. And also because I like her character design. She's my. She, she is my. My favorite character design in the entire game, it belongs to her. Um, Shui E. Or sh am I pronouncing that right? Shui E? Yeah. Yeah. Silver Wolf and Julian, go on y'all walk. It's very nice, but you need to farm like crazy. I'm willing to do it. Seven viewers now. That's interesting. Finally, I hit, I hit the seven mark. Before it was six. Now I say seven. Okay, cool. So, the team I'm going to bring, I want to bring two Quantums and two Electros. So, my other Electro character would be her. Oh, never mind. I got the whole team set. Never mind. Okay, now it's just start. Now, hopefully, it goes faster this time. Yes, I know. You need to farm Alcron. Yes, I know I have to farm Alcron. I'm just saying, I'm gonna put Shui E on the back burner for later. Show no mercy. We're still in phase five of the the rounds. Conflict is pitiless. <laughs> that should did damage to his overshield. What? Who's next? 
disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. No more. Yin and Yang. We already have phase four. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Finally, we clapped them. Yeah, we're gonna get through this one faster. Oh my goodness. Bro, if they don't hurry up and kill this mother... We already in phase three. If they don't hurry up and kill them... Homegirl, um, fi um, I'm about to say Firefly. Oh my goodness. Homegirl, um, Sile doing her thing right now. She helping the team push forward. Or well, she's killing this health bar relatively faster. Bro, if y'all don't hurry up and merc these niggas. I mean, she got good cake on her, so it's not really a, you know, insult or whatever. She got good cake, so you right. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. We still have not killed him. If this dude don't get out the way, Bro, he wasn't even the last boss. That's the worst part. Isn't this like boss number two? Yeah, we had. This is disgusting work. Show no mercy. Disappear. It's not even gonna get done in time. Illusions of the past. You will get better as you focus on your best characters. At least we got an A. Now we can do the last one, yay. Let's go get this done. Hmm. Oh, hold up. Perfect. Perfect. So I know it seems. And now I get to see adventure. Well, it's not that. Now I get to see adventuring in action. And it isn't Shui. Check if you have a temple after. All right, I'll check it. Give me one second. I'm one, two, boom, boom. Really? We only run with. Hold up. This is curious. I want to see how Hanya is built. Light cone. She got this. Skills. This. Relics. This. The only reason I'm doing this because I can so I can look at all the relics and all that other stuff, so that I'll know what relics I want to grab from, even if it is default relics. Okay, I think I got like at least three pieces of this for my homeboy. So when I pull from him, I'll have his stuff ready. At least some of it. Okay, so now who would I need for the final? 
I guess I need a fire carrot. Oh, shoot, Topaz is here. So I guess these two getting off the squad. Uh-huh, thank you. Now, who's the third person I can put on the squad? Oh, my family members came back. Now I can't talk crazy, so I'm going to whisper. Hopefully my door closed, hold up. Let me take sure show my door lock. Hold up, let me make sure they ain't send me a text. Give me one second. Okay, I ain't got no text on my phone, so they ain't hit my phone up saying so no text on So Okay, I'm good. Look at the adventuring build. Concert for two. That's his light gone. Four, 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 three. 10, 10, 10, 10, all the way through. He got two pieces of insert salat, so t what, how do you pronounce that? And Knights of Purity Palace. No Eidolons. Dr. Rachel, what he got on him actually? Let me take a look at this. I know I'm taking forever and whatnot. I think I may have this light cone. I don't remember, four, 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 three, okay. 10 piece increases. Oh, so this works good for him too, I think. Topaz, the cake I missed out on. Oh my god, you see that, right? Still got curvature. It still looked thick. It still looked good. Anyway, I really mess with her onesie pieced outfit though. It's tough. Anyway, let's get back to it so we don't be wasting time. Okay. Okay, this is whatever. I don't gotta keep looking at all that. I gotta add a third person to the party, so it's going to be her. Just for the sake of adding skill points. No, actually, it's gonna be him. No, no hold up. Yeah, it's gonna be him. This is why he is weird. What, you talking about me? I'm not weird. Oh, you said it. Hold up. What was the problem now? I clicked the wrong character to bring with me? Who should I brought with me? I should have brought Hanya. That team sucks. Mistakes high rewards. Okay, true. We all we are all weird here. There's no doubt about that. Opportunity doesn't knock on its own, you know. Was Sparkle even on the list of characters to bring? I got a C rank off the rip. Okay, so I don't have a C. Okay, I have Sparkle myself, but she's not built. So she might not survive at all. So I guess I'm replacing her with Sparkle. Oh, never mind. Adventuring got a shield. I'm talking out my behind right now. I'm so stupid. I'm the most normal person. No, you not. How you gonna sit there and lie out your mouth right there? <laughs> Tell me, oh, I'm the no most noble person here. Do you want to explain these couple chat logs a while back? You know I can scroll backwards, right? <laughs> I quote, quote, I quote from you, eats from the floor, tail plug wagging. You want to explain that? <laughs> Please explain that. Miss, I'm the most normal person here. Wait, who else supposed to bring? Oh. Sparkle, yeah, Sparkle on the team. Okay, now we can go. Autoplay. Evaluation begin. Go Nubby. Sure, I'll play along. The dice have been bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. 
hedge your bets. It's on me. Your answers? Answer me. Zero points. SAS Pekipi. You gonna lie again out your mouth when it was in your own text log with your ID labeled no on it? Rush. Are you serious, Silverwolf? Also, success. my apologies for wasting it. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. But I'm gonna put it back on autoplay and see what happens. Are we still in phase five right now? This is good. These fall attacks are getting crazy. Uh huh. Oh my goodness, it's such an immaculate, it's immaculate. Okay, this team is delicious. I'm messing with it. The fact that I only have one, two, three. Okay, I would potentially only have three of the four members on the team is going to be really sad. Granted, one of them could replace with Clara. Nuh-uh. You can't be a nuh-uh. <laughs> yes. I can be the nah uh with a uh huh. That's how that works. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Answer me. Free. Knowledge, the measure of truth. And falsehood. Zero points. Freeze. Oh my goodness, it's about to get crazy. Investing in victory means playing the last game. Can you find the answer? Bust. No, or go sit in the corner. I'm an unforgiving master around here. Bro, this back-to-back -back fall of attack stuff is going on right now is crazy. There's even more reason why to pull for adventuring. There's even more reason. Oh, the auto battle wasted it. Ah, uh, whoa, we spamming moves. The measure of truth and falsehood. Zero points. Takes out <laughs> tail plug and throws it at him. Zero points. Then I respond. Hold up. Then I respond with a counter move called Weave Nation and I dodge it. <laughs> and I grab it while it's still in mid air behind me and throw it back at your forehead. Goodness. Bust. Wait, what Are type of elemental thing is she? Oh, she's fire? Really? Pause. You would have had two more adventuring follow-up attacks if if it weren't wasted. Oh, okay. I understand. You're getting cleaned up right now. Can you find the answer? Does the salmon shave your bed, your head, ball? Like that's gonna stop me, bro? Do you know how many times I've had a bald fade haircut for like majority of my middle school life? Not even just middle school life, all the way up to like somewhere. No, I stopped getting bald fades in high school. But bro, having a whole empty, clean dome, that ain't nothing new to me. See that 2-7 right now? Yeah, I see it. Yeah, cause I know it builds up every time he's attacked or his team members are attacked while his shield is up. I know that. Now it's at four. Right. 
use that when that okay use all when that is low when you see all is up you effed up okay so that's the problem okay i'm telling y'all y'all need to start putting some of these um information and stuff in the comment section of my um either my community tab i keep telling y'all to do that <laughs> And I do not be finding it on here at all. I'm telling y'all. Y'all be giving me good advice and y'all don't be putting it here. I don't remember half this stuff. You can't talk for a week. Who, me? First of all, if I don't talk, you gonna try to engage in conversation with me when I can't talk? What, you want me to type it out? Oh, well, I better turn this autoplay off. Just in case. Your answers? Answer me. So, you want me to stop talking for a whole week? First of all, that's gonna be extremely boring. Granted, I'll do it, but you're gonna have to remind me in case I forget. But like, bro, how you? I know you're gonna start a conversation off with me. Opportunity doesn't yes, you need to type it. Know. If I told you to stop being mean to <laughs> no, I'm a villain. I'm not gonna stop. <laughs> Adventuring's build up is like four stacks of. Hold up. Enter. Bam, four stacks of seven. Okay, I'm just not gonna do his ult then. Simple. Get the it's shield up. I'm asking questions. Freeze to death. The eternal freeze. You son of a. We'll bury you. Absolutely not. We're not this losing like this. Knowledge, the measure of truth, and falsehood. So now I do his ultimate, right? Because now it's empty. Perfect. The dice have been cast. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Now I gotta get the shield back up. And we didn't make it and defeat him in time, which sucks. Because I wanted to win. Oh my goodness. Now I feel like we wasted so much time trying to defeat everybody else. When we could have clapped her. Lame bar. Ugh. I'm upset. At least I got all A's. That's the well, except for like the first two. I got like triple S. On the first one, because it was pretty easy to do. But ever since then, I've been on a decline. Shoot, I wish my grades in school looked like this. Who was this? Claim. Okay, so let me see how much I got out of that. Bro, I do not even have enough for another 10 pull. Hmm. Only got enough for eight? Okay. Oh shoot, my stream glitching and twitching and glitching. Hold up. Do one temple do one pull? No. I'm not gonna do no pull until I get like at least an absolute ten at least I get absolute ten. Hold up. Never mind, hold up. Give me a second. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Now I'm going to have nine. Yep, that's going to equate to nine. Eight. Hold up. Hold up. How many I got left on here? Two, eight, nine, ten. Oh, perfect. It's a ten pull. So, I guess we're doing a ten pull now. 
Confirm. I guess we're doing a tempo now. You have to be good to get enough jades. Use starlight. Yeah, I use it. Okay, so we're about to do a temple. Pray for me. Send me good luck right now so that I'll get him within the next temple. Send me some good luck, please. <laughs> I'm going to need it from y'all. And Julian and Silver Wolf, don't send me no bad luck. See, I already called it before you even typed it. I knew you was going to do some stuff like this. I swear, we got haters in here. JL, you the only real one. <laughs> All right, let's get it. Three, two, one. This will be pull number 60. I can't tell what it looked like. This thing really gonna make me work for this. Jesus Christ. It's really gonna make me work for it. We 60 pulls deep. Another copy of Serval. <laughs> That's okay. It is a mess. It's disgusting. Shoot, I guess all the luck I had was wasted on Alcaron's banner. She did me dirty. She took all my luck. I had like back-to-back -back five star characters coming on that. She took all my luck, so now I can't get my adventuring. It is y'all fault. Both of you. Julian and Zeruf, y'all need to go in the corner. But I need to lock both y'all up in the prison and drop you underneath the ocean. Because y'all the reason I lost this. Honestly. But, hold up. <laughs> Let's go look into the bank account real quick. Just for like a little peek. That's all. Nothing too major. There's nothing too crazy. I'm going to have an M-Tash moment. Because if y'all saw how M-Tash was when it came down to that Alcron banner. He said he wasn't going to pull on it. Ended up pulling on it. He folded Hit me with it, Julian. Better luck next time. You lucky I can't grab you by the neck from where I'm at. If I had the ability to rip through this computer and grab you by the neck, I would. <laughs> Good for you, J JW. JL. At least you didn't fall. Me, I don't know what I did. I don't remember what... I know why. I pulled for adventuring because people were talking about some. Oh, you need her. If you're a new player, you need her. She's going to be good for your account, XYZ. That's the only reason I pulled her. Man, if I had only stopped after the first pull, I probably would have gotten my guarantee. And I would have saved up all my wishes that I had. But I was trying to get a copy of Pela, which I had to sacrifice wishes for. Too bad, why, why, too bad, so sad. It's not going to be no too bad, so sad. I'm going to get him before this week ends. Not Okay, not this week. Before the next three weeks end. Shoot, I might trade off Homeboy Adventuring for Jing Liu if I need to. I'm going to think about it. But we're going to continue. What time is it? It's already 1.05. Use magic debit card. Shoot, that's if it's going to allow me to use it. But sometimes it tells you. If you look at it, be like, nope, can't use it. Let me take a look at something real quick. Hmm. Let me think. I gotta calculate. Hmm.
You say don't bother with Jing Liu, but like I only want her because she's another Ice character. That's the one of the main reasons I'm getting her. I'm not getting her because I want to. I want to have you know, um, Alcron Power Creeper. I just like you know. I want to get damage dealers, and I don't want to have at least one to rely on all the time. Because I think Jing Liu pretty cool. I like her character design. I really want her. Don't do it. Fine. I'm not gonna wish for her. Not this time then. I'll wait till next time. Shoot, that's if Blade doesn't roll up before she does. You have Clara. I mean, Clara. <laughs> Hold up. You know what? Uh, yeah, I guess we're gonna have to use a little bit of money magic tonight. Just this one time. And this is gonna be the last time I touch this money magic. You have plenty of DPS. Really? Name them off. Name off every DPS. Hold on. Let me go ahead and just pull up my character chart. Where the character? Where are they? There they go. Boom. Okay. Name off all the characters that I have that are DPS. Really quickly. Because I'm curious to know who you're referring to. Okay, I know Ching Chue, or, yeah, Ching Chue, I know she's a DPS, without a shower without, I know that, for a fact. Okay, Alcron, and, <laughs> no, stop it, <laughs> I'm, list them all off, I'm not just look, using her, list them all off, please, please. <laughs> okay. Akron, Ratio, Don, Hung, Clara, Serval. So these are all damaged DPS from how you're listing them off, etc. Cool. The first one that I need to work on are, okay, so it looks like first two that I need to work on are Adventuring and Clara. Okay, cool. I'll do that. Screw Serval. What? Why? With that shot with that, I will be building my Herta. There is no question about that. I'm not listening to what nobody in this chat says. I will be building Herta. I don't care. She, genuinely, she is my favorite unit to play all the time. Every single time. Anytime the sh anyone's weakness break or whatever crap happens, she always spinning around. I like it. I'm going to build her regardless. I don't care. <laughs> There's nothing stopping me from doing it. I will do it. I mean, we all know that. Well, best characters, but in terms of character writing, I say Adventurine got it in the bag. Okay, we'll do at 7, at 3.45 p.m. on Sunday. What is you talking about? Oh, wait, you gotta go? Or something? Or did I say something earlier? Hold on, what? Oh, that's right. I was gonna use some money magic. I uh -huh, forgot so, 14, can I do 14? Well, 16, hmm. You know what? The 16 won't be worth it. Because I can figure something out. Okay, I hear you. I'll put uh, I'll put Alcron first. I hear you. I hear you. I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a Google note. No, I'm gonna put in my notepad in my phone on what characters to build first, and uh, of course Alcron will be at the top of the list. Oh wow! Look at that. That was crazy. What was that? That was that was wild, bro.
that looked like some crazy magic that just happened. Mm. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I magically got... Mm. If you're wondering which one I purchased for, I purchased the cheapest one. Well, not the cheapest one. One probably like the second cheapest one, if you wanted to know. AKA $16. That's it. Which is fine. I can deal with losing $16. I got like $13 in my cash app. I hear ya. I hear ya. I hear your recommendations. Shoot, y'all breaking my back with them. Now, we about to do another temple. I better get him within this next temple because this is about to be 70. So, we about to do it. I'm not even going to ask for y'all good luck because Julian and Silver Wolf, y'all did me dirty. I'm not even going to worry about y'all good luck. Let's count it down. Three, two, one. Go. 70. Don't tell me they really about to make me work for it. They really trying to make me work for it. We're 70 pulls in. This is disgusting. Oh, well, at least I got another copy of Lynx. I guess that's good. Another copy of Serval, too. At least it's decent. At least it wasn't a bunch of light cones. This mother effer really trying to make me work for it. Jesus Christ. Oh my goodness. Better yet, shoot. What time is it right now? It's 1.12? I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going until I get sick of this. So, I guess the next best thing to do is simulate a universe? No. Hold up. What should I do right now? I'm not wasting those two pulls. Are you wild? There is no point in wasting those two pu those two pulls. I'm not wish I'm not wishing nothing until I get me another set of ten pulls. Are y'all suggesting that I use my last two pulls? Like that's gonna change something? Give me a reason for why I should. Give me a good reason why I should. Right now. Shoot, if some of y'all hit that subscribe button, I may do it. But until then, y'all gotta think of a good reason. I ain't gonna do squat with them last two pulls. Y'all wanna see my downfall? Absolutely not. Mm, okay then. <laughs> okay, so I only see one good justified reason, and it's from Julian. But I'm not doing it. <laughs> and like I thought, y'all not about to hit that subscribe button. If y'all was gonna hit the subscribe button, I probably would have wasted the last two just for the fun of it. <laughs> So y'all can have y'all little benefit. I would have done it, but y'all ain't do it. So it is what it is. There ain't no way you will get it within two pulls. Of course not. <laughs> but y'all the ones want to make me waste it, don't you? Already subscribed, already subbed. Let's take a look, cause I know I dropped one subscription. <sighs> Y'all say y'all already subscribed. <sighs> Some people got bet got better luck with one pull. <laughs> it's hard for me to believe that you subscribed, Silver Wolf. I can't remember if you even subscribed. <laughs> it probably was a while ago, but I don't remember it. J now JL, I don't even know if you subscribed either, because I don't remember no notification talking about when you subscribed. It could have been a while ago, but also, I still don't remember that one either. So, I might waste these. I might. 
unless my common sense already slaps me in my face first before I make the decision. Uh, mm. I can unsubscribe right now if you want to see. Do it. <laughs> I'll wait. I got time. It's Friday or it's Saturday morning. Shoot, I'm not going to sleep till like 3 o'clock in the morning anyway. Shoot, you know what? Shoot, I might drag this stream out all the way to 3 o'clock. That'd be crazy. You got 29 subs. You can check, right? It's easy. Dude, though. That'll work, bro. <laughs> Better, let me go check my YouTube studio. Okay, I know I got my YouTube studio on my phone. Just to double check stuff. Let me find it. Give me a second. Mm. Bro, if you don't show me where this YouTube... There it is. Done. Just did... I'm in the YouTube studio right now. It says 28 right now. That's what it's telling me. Let me refresh it. Refresh it. Refresh it. Yeah, I see it. So. <laughs> at least you prove you was correct. That's all I can say about that. All right, I'll waste the last two wishes against my better judgment for the sake of the quote unquote, the content. I'll waste it. Appreciate the subscription though. <sighs> I really don't want to against my better judgment. I'm about to do something so absolutely stupid. And this is to appease y'all. This ain't to appease me. It's to appease y'all. Do know this. <laughs> Tell me something. Nah, just wait. <laughs> oh, so now y'all want me to wait. Why happened earlier? Y'all was egging me on talking about some wasted for the sake of the content. <laughs> now y'all want to be considerate? That's crazy. <laughs> Okay, I won't do it. <laughs> now, what I will do right now is probably go dive in the simulated universe. Do it. Do it. No. <laughs> Dude, we're not doing this, Silver Wolf. Shoot, until I figure out how I can get y'all to cash at me money through this YouTube system, then that'll be a different discussion for a different day. Just spend 200... <laughs> I don't have that type of money to use. Are you crazy? Shoot, I'm going to be waiting four weeks until my next paycheck. And unfortunately, by the time that happens, Adventuring's banner is going to be gone. And I'm going to be sad. Because I missed out on my follow-up attack combo. I'm probably going to cry now I'm thinking about it. <laughs> I'm I know you're not old enough to have a job yet, Silver Wolf. <laughs> I'm talking to Julian face ass. Well, not Julian. I meant to say JL. You need 500 subs. So better luck next time. <laughs> Bro, I swear I'm so tired of you. Ooh, I'm tired. Oh, Julian, I swear, bro. <laughs> Screw all that. I'm going to collect what I need to collect before these next three weeks end. Hold up. Am I supposed to be going? Uh, yeah, simulated universe. Oh, shoot, my twin bro done arrived home, so he might kick me off the system. Bro, you can say jail if you want to. Oh, oh, appreciate it. Shoot, I was getting tired of calling you by your word by word, letter by letter stuff. My bad. No, no offense. It just, it was a tongue twister for me. And manifesting bad luck, you are manifesting bad luck. You're a villain, along with your accomplice known as Julian. <laughs> you both deserve prison time. Oh boy, there you go. Hold up. Give me a second.
It's for a quick way. Uh, I think I started since eight, around 8.40. I don't know how much. I don't finish the story. I'm just trying to run on a quick pace, but... Ooh, my head. Yeah, my subscription. Y'all heard it. I know y'all heard the conversation from at least from the door. Punch him in the... Nah, I can't do that to him. Y'all heard the conversation. Y'all heard what he said. It's Friday. My job, it is Friday night. He ready to play on his game, get on his God of War XYZ. So, I was, it's sad to say, but I gotta go. I don't want to. I want to drag this out to 3 o'clock in the morning. I really do. But this ain't my system until I get mine, which will be four weeks from now. So, if I don't get a venturing by the time my four-week paycheck comes... Best believe I'm going to get my own PS5 by that time. See y'all later. I'll see y'all Monday. I appreciate y'all being here and witnessing Silver Wolf and Julian give me bad luck. I hope y'all have bad luck on y'all next pulls too. Because y'all did me dirty. Are these niggas still here? Hold up. Cause still telling me four people here. <laughs> good job, Silver Wolf, and good night. <laughs> Don't tell her no good job. Y'all some villains. I'm labeling y'all as the villain squad from now on. Granted, I'm gonna run around a little bit. I'm just gonna drag it out just a little bit. <laughs> I'll wait till all y'all leave down the end the stream. Your twin is here too? Yeah, he just got back home from work. And he ready to kick me off the system. Shoot, he might walk back through that door and ask me why I'm still on it. So now I really gotta go. Really, really, really. I really gotta go now. We are not. <laughs> Don't get lost, damn it. We're not dragging this out anymore, because I promise you, he will come out. Uh, he will come into my room and rip the PlayStation out the wall if he need to. He will. He not playing. Best believe me, I witnessed it with my own bare hands before. <laughs> Even though he's the younger brother. So shoo, scram, go, get on out of here. I'll see y'all Monday. Especially you, Julian. Why are you st no? The question is, why are you still here? It's time to go. Why are you still watching? I'm ending the stream once I know all y'all left. That's how I'll do it. Wait, when do you start? Oh, when do I start streaming? Uh, I usually choose the time between seven o'clock, eight o'clock, or nine o'clock. If I don't start my stream around that time, the latest is gonna be ten. Now, if I don't start it at ten at all, that means I'm not streaming at all. But my usual streaming time is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. That's for Hawkeye Star Rail. But since Genshin's 4.6 is going to drop, I will be playing it. So I probably will be streaming Thursday and Friday of next week. We can wait and see. I'll let y'all know later or in a community post. Okay, cool. You got that information? If so, time for y'all to go. And now they should because now I should be the last person here. Cause I got my phone and my computer. I'm not gonna leave, <laughs> bro. Get on somewhere. I'm serious. I'm not playing this game. I'm serious. I'm dead serious. He will come through this door and strangle me by the neck. You should know a Discord server. I don't have a Discord server. I I tried to figure out that Discord stuff a while ago, probably last year. I didn't worry about it. I didn't even bother. Make it. Uh, but then I gotta put through the effort to make a space on my phone and I don't feel like it. I'm lazy. Hold up. Do I even. St no, I uninstalled it. Okay, hold up. this was gonna happen. Okay? I promise y'all this. I get that. Okay, if y'all still here, I'm gonna say this right now. Probably later, 
Okay, good. Y'all leaving. Good. Thank goodness. I'll let y'all know in the community t- tab if I'm gonna make a um Discord and y'all can chat it up in there. Cool. I'll let y'all know that Monday. Okay. Okay. Now get lost. <laughs> so better not still be here. That's all I know. She better be gone. Oh, I should say this. For any people coming in at the end of the live stream, at the end of the video, uh, like and subscribe for more and chat it up with me later. Shoot, I may have a Discord made up probably on Monday when I make my final decision whether I'm gonna make a Discord. So y'all can chat it up in the Discord and all that cool stuff, okay? So like and subscribe for more. This is Calamash Game, Calab, no, this is Cala Games signing out. Bye. See y'all Monday. And I mean it. <laughs>